another week, it's another Mars, and this week we are brought to you not by fidget spinners. Matt has a fidget spinner. Whoop. A fidget spinner. What? Rob has a fidget spinner. Yeah. How sure. you liking it? Um, I'm annoyed that I like it, I guess. I'm kind of like, hoo-hoo-wee, ha-ha. It's, it's spinning. It's uh I feel like fucking like like a like a darn fool. You should. You should feel like a darn fool cuz that's exactly how I felt when I was fidget spinning in San Bernardino. Oh, you were you were spinning there? Well, I had no desire to fidget. But you just fidget pick it spin. Up? But uh Eric and Linda's kids had one. They mm-hmm. they actually had many. And which one do you want? I was like I'll have that one. That little Batman. I had a Batman similar to your Batman. Oh, yeah. And then, I mean, I wasn't going to take one. You know, this is their fidget spinners. And then when I went to go hang out with my brother, same thing with his kids. Tio Robert, look at fidget spinners. You want one? Sure. And I kept finding myself in both, in both instances constantly reaching for it and fidget spinning. And then I would put it in my pocket. And I'd put my hand in my pocket and play with it. The fidget spinner. Oh, the fidget spinner. Good. Yeah, yeah. I just grab my dick. Yeah. No. I would just play with the fidget spinner. And then I would find myself, I found myself a couple times in public just fidget spinning at the Lavender Festival. And then I was highly... I know, I know that you know that you're fidget spinning with your hand in, in, in your pocket, but... Of course. Anyone else looking over, you got your hand in your pocket and it's just going to town. Yeah, but the thing is, is I'm like... Oh, it's it's there just would, my fidget spinner. There, well, there would be nothing. It's like, uh, it just wouldn't. It's not like there's like an outward thrusting motion. It's all, just like all, jumbling. All, like all you need is a couple of good flicks. Like a lost chap, uh, a lost chapstick. Oh no! All you need is a couple of good little, good little spins. But that's, that's, there's not enough room in my pockets to spin. Not like before, where I had all the room in my pockets and I could put yearbooks, and other jazzes. In my pockets. Oh, the chests. Oh, yeah. Many, many of things I would put in my pocket and walk out with. My, Not um, from stores, but other places. I've always had this. I I never got the, the big baggy pants thing that you rock sometimes. I did. No. no. It was comfortable. It's highly comfortable. A lot of, a lot of leg room. It, uh, it made me happy. How was your week, Rob? And it's just been a regular week. It's been a regular? No. Yeah. No. Just, I mean, just working? Not, nothing. No. No crazy? It's, no. No. It's just been, it's not keeping me d- d- distracted. It's 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 just nonstop. Yeah, it's nonstop. That's, I, just, I, had, I had to put my down. I don't even know what I did with my, there it is. So I want to know, because something came up, and I want your opinion on it, because I was like, I want to hear Rob's opinion on this. And I doubt we're the only podcast to actually cover this. Mm-hmm. So, you know, why not? We're not trying to be super original, but I want to hear Rob's idea. Mm-hmm. Um, have you heard of the universal dark universe that's that'll, that'll be coming out soon? What is this, a movie? Uh... It is. It's a, it's, a connect, it's a connected movie, like series of movies that has started with that uh, mummy reboot. With Tom, with Tom Cruise. Uh, who was telling me? I think Robin was telling me about it. That they're, it's like essentially they're trying to reboot the, uh, uh, what is it? The Warner Brothers, the uh, monsters. What is it called? There's a specific name for it. Like all the monsters. Yeah. It's it's under the dark universe. Oh, I don't know. And they're no. gonna have mummy, yeah, visible mummy. man, werewolf. Bride of Frankenstein. Yeah, I just think it's called the the. Uh, I see. I just lost it again. The Universal Monsters or something. Yeah. Yeah. And what do you think? And they're gonna have their own movie. All of them. They all get their own movie, and then they're and all. Then they're gonna. And then they're, they're all gonna, gonna. Avengers it. They're all gonna get together and fight Thanos. Yeah. Now, if they fought Thanos, I think that'd be pretty badass. But other than that, I have no investment in it. No. No. 
because I, I never I never got into it anyways. Johnny Depp as the Invisible Man. Really? Yeah. I'll give him credit there. No. Who else? Well, Tom, it was Tom Cruise and just the Mummy. Tom Cruise right? and he the Mummy, but it wasn't shit. I haven't seen it yet, so I don't know. Like why? So, a big thing that I was reading on Twitter mainly is that uh, how are so you get the, like say like a franchise like The Mummy, mm-hmm. you get Tom Cruise in it, but he's not. Is he going to be in the extended universe? No, did he die in it? Like, did you hear anything about that spoiling? No. No? I don't think he's not going to stick around for it. It's not fucking Mission Impossible. The rebirth. Mission, Mission Impossible. Um, um. Like, Tom Cruise isn't one of those actors who's going to sign, like, some multi-fucking multi-movie deal. But not for this shit. No. Oh, no, no, no. Maybe it's if Scientology be, made it, you'd yeah, be like, yeah, it's totally. It's going to be awful. Oh, yeah. I'm no. I thought it was a pretty bad idea, but uh, I was like, "Oh, because it's you know the whole shared universe idea in movies is good." Mm-hmm. Since like, I think we talked about it since since Alien. Sorry, since Predator Two, when they had the alien skull in the background. Uh-huh. Since then, since I saw that, I was like, "Oh, movies can be t- t- together." Yeah, if, if, instead if, of just be sequels and together, they can actually share. So the u- the Univi? Yeah. I mean, I don't have a problem with it as long as it makes sense. Like, I, again, like, I, I don't have a lot of background on these. Uh, Shared universe uh, ideas? Well, this one in particular, because I don't, like, they're all monsters. So the mummy, Wolfman, Frankenstein, Invisible Man, all this like, shit. Like, they work together, I guess. What I'm afraid of is that it's just without, we're going to blink, and it's all of a sudden going to be the, the leave extraordinary g- g- gentleman. Would Remember that? that with uh, Sean Connery as Alec Quartermain oh, and Sean Connery. Sean Connery and uh, was that cartoon that he did? Uh, cartoon. Remember I showed you that cartoon that he did. I didn't show you that shit. No? He did some children's cartoon. Oh, where he's like some crazy uncle, like treasure hunter. Have you seen that interview with him when he was like, you know, young Sean Connery, and it's like, and like. The interview was like, you've been noted saying that sometimes, like, you think that every now and then it's okay to hit a woman. He's like, yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I saw that. It was fucking, it was pretty, uh, pretty epic, as they say. Ooh, epic with our fidget spinners. Very fidget spinner epic. Lol. Raffle. That Lol. shit was on point. YOLO. What else do kids say? Lit. That shit was lit. Lit. Savage. Ooh. Uh, Sean Connery was savage. I, I haven't heard Wham say savage. Really? No. I don't know how he cool came it out is today, still. and he was like, "Don't you? Oh, sorry. Don't, don't you wish your girlfriend oh, don't, was hot like me? Don't you hate it when you when you when your hair is on point, but you got to wear a hat and work? That was a sentence. Yeah, yeah. This is a real life sentence. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Way to go. Um. Way to quick go. question. Go ahead. Another one. You can leave it in, or you can actually edit this out. Huh? Do. So you have a food handler's card. I do. Californian. Huh? Did work supply you with one? If work supplies you with one, a majority of the time, it is only for that place. That's what I said. And there are other tests because a lot of people, like if you get a food handler's card from work, a lot of those supervisors are able to certify those that work under that license. Yeah. Or under that, that big umbrella. But if you go to a place and sit there for fucking eight hours or whatever it takes, then that is a universal food handler's card, which some places don't accept. Yeah. So like, I, I have a California cert, but Wham d- doesn't have any. Doesn't have any? No. He's never had one. Hmm. And I guess a health inspector came into the bar he works at mm-hmm. and was like, where is it? Like, I don't have one. And then he has, like, eight days to, to, to get one. Or oh, what an idiot. You don't say, I don't have one. Yeah, right? God. Well, uh, that that was going to be my next question. Like, oh, well, he's going to be fucked if the fucking health inspector comes. No, I think... Well, he's not going to be fucked. I think but... they're going to be like, well, get one. And then they come back. They're not going to fire you on the spot. If you ha- They write you up, and they're like, where's his? Like, you know, they re- remember your name. Right. But... Like, his work, like, you shouldn't be hiring people unless you you fucking... That's what I said. I said usually... That's his job's fault. 
But but so Connor, who knows nothing about this, says yeah. that shouldn't your job buy you one? Nope. And he was look and he we asked the lawyer brother and we got all into it. And I was like, I'm pretty sure no. You got you gotta get no. your own. No, you're right. It's just like when you go work construction, like you can't go work in construction and expect them to supply you tools. Like specialty tools, sure. Yeah. But like if you're if you're a framer, like you have to show up with your tools. Yeah. Like I didn't do shit for the longest time when I got it, when I first got into construction because all I had was it, like it was it was mandatory that you had a tool belt with a hammer and nail puller and something else. That way you could do shit work. So I went out and bought a belt and fucking hammer or whatever I needed. And if somebody needed help and they weren't using their nail gun, they'd be like, "Hey, I'm using my saw. Grab my nail gun and fucking put some shit together." And I would. And it was fun. And I bought my own. Yeah. And it was cool. I still have it. It's over there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I still got a majority of my tools. You got a keyboard on, on top of the printer. Uh, yeah. Half on top of my printer, half on top of my drum set. Oh, yeah. Hmm? Yeah, remember that? I have a drum set. Yeah, I'm Rob's a drummer. Yeah. Yes. Did you guys know that? No. Don't Tweet get, us don't get at me at the real Rob. Tweet at us if you, if you didn't know that. We've got a couple of new likes again. We did. We got a couple of new We're likes. We're on 70-something now. Mm-hmm. That's not bad. No, not at all. But I didn't mean to burst your bubble when I was telling you, like, oh, well, look at some of those pages. Yeah, you really did. And, I, and I've and i been looking at you guys. Yeah. Ben. Who, but it's just those names. that I'm not saying that they can't be uh, following, but... <laughs> the, the names are too fake? Like, it, well, it's not that they're fake. Like, they could just, like... I'm sure somebody in Ethiopia... Here's somebody named, uh, whatever, Matt, and they're just like, I don't know about Matt. Or, I mean, maybe not Ethiopia, but you know what I mean? Like some, like, removed, like, like a tribe or some shit like this. And they're just like, fucking Joseph? Fuck is a Joseph? You know what I mean? I suppose. Well, but, no, we're, it's, it's not all weird names. Well, no, 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 no. There's like 4% of it's really weird. But if you click on their, their thing, it's like they... It says friends, none to show. So I don't know if they're just hiding it. But there's also, like, no posts. There's, like, two pictures. But if you look at it, our likes don't correlate with our downloads. What do you mean? So if people are just accepting and liking, but they're not going and finding, they're not finding the podcast. It's just like, oh, what's this? I like it. Which, it's not that we don't appreciate it. Oh, yeah, we do. But it makes me think of, like, okay, so both of us paid X amount to promote this page. Yeah. To do what? To get some... $500. To get either people that will have no fucking interest in it somehow. Yeah. Or people that will just click the like button. We got a couple of deals the other day on uh, on a Sunday. No, no, no. We, yeah, we've been getting... I'm just saying, like... I, need to, I should check in now. When we did... uh. Like, I don't know, we got, like, 20 people one day, but we only had, like, three listens. Yeah. Which, fine, save it for later, do what it is. I'm just trying to figure well, when, out, like, so I'm just trying to it, figure out if promoting the page is worth it or it whatever. The listens? It should. It should cr- count them over all the platforms, uh, iTunes, Stitcher, Spreaker, and hopefully iHeartRadio is up. I don't know. They said two weeks. So, oh. Ugh, pardon me. Very yawny today. Yeah, we've had a sleepy day. It's yeah, sunny. It's, uh, it's, a, it's it's a hot. It's a hot San Diego right now. It's it's hot. Uh, that night went to bed at like one, and I got up at three. No, four. I was up at four because I like to get up two hours before work. Speaking of being sleepy, see what I did there? Ooh. Yeah. What about being sleepy, Ooh. Matt? Ooh. In your dreams. <laughs> I can't do it, Freddy. You know? I try. I was. I was, the majority of the time. I I was watching it. Uh, I tried to do a Freddy, and, okay. and I uh, and I can't do it. It's. It doesn't seem like a hard thing to do, but it it seems like a very uncomfortable thing to like, do. Like like he would, because I was trying to figure out like what what would he say, and he would like have someone trapped in like a bubble of water, and he'd be like, "Don't mean to burst your bubble." <laughs> yeah, I didn't realize how shitty it is. Well, apparently it got. Apparently it's like three, four, five when they started like f- the one liner Freddy. Four? No, it was it was from the beginning. 
No, but I mean like the like the oh when when the they comical deaths and all that. Oh, when they got on the train to fucking Funnyville. Yeah. Yeah. Choo choo. Uh. Uh, but yeah, that's what, what I was watching because I was started watching the I started going back and watching the history of it and like you know just try to get little little fun facts. Yeah, and um, they were like, yeah, from four on, it was just fucking trash. Yeah. So yeah. to get into it, we're uh, watching what? What, what, what are um, we on? We are on Nightmare. We started, you know, we just picked a random one. Yeah, we didn't just picked a, I, I've never watched them, so Matt picked it. I haven't um, watched. I've. This is my first time watching this one. Oh, you've never seen five? No, we're really? watching. Yeah, the, the dream the dream child. child. I have seen one, but I can't remember it. I I I can't remember any of them. One was. I mean, yeah, one was still shitty, I but did, one wasn't that bad. I did watch Freddy vs. Jason recently. Oh, did you? And that's kind of shit. <laughs> oh, of course. Uh, but no, five. I I like from. Not remembering one to something, mm. one to whatever, I thought five held up. Maybe if I go back and watch one, I'd be like, actually, this is much better. Five sucks. You know what? Like, for how shitty the, the all the, I don't even know if they were animatronics, but whatever they call, or they're calling special effects. I like, don't think, okay, I have a soft spot for practical effects. I do too. I really like, like the bathtub yeah. scene. Yeah. Like where the hand comes out. Yeah. That was done by them putting, they built that set on top of a swimming pool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then did all that shit. But like even when. Which was cool. When your one Greta in five was dying and she got, you know, her face was, full and her cheeks were getting bigger. Oh, it's still, yeah, it's yeah. still fake. Of, like it's still. Right. But, but it's, prost- it's prosthetics. Yeah. But it doesn't, you know what I mean? If they did a CGI. Yeah, it would have been you overdone. Could, it would have been like, oh, but the fact that it, and then when it, she was crawling out of the fridge. Mm-hmm. That looked like it was it was the actress who was crawling out of the fridge and right back back when they, it was a craft and they had to figure out how do yeah. we do this how do we make it look right like, not necessarily how do we make it look real but how do we make it look right like I and that's we, a big difference while we were even considering of doing a podcast we watched I made I made you watch the thing because I love mm. the thing because that's all practical right and it, hey I think we should have saw the, the the thing but they 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 did a sequel which was a prequel. Mm-hmm. Uh, and did you watch that one? No. Oh. And they did, they they the 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 thing is they filmed it with with practical effects, mm. and then they added special effects after. Oh, did they? And it just it was a bomb. The film didn't do well. Really? No. Oh. And a lot of people were like, it was all practical. I don't know why they needed to make it look so shit. Huh. Yeah. Did they did they bring it back to the Swiss? Huh? Did they bring it back to Switzerland? Yeah. It was. It was. Mm. Do you remember the first one? Yeah, vaguely. And then at, at the start, the, the dogs running. Remember the dogs, the thing. Oh and then, yeah, then, yeah, then yeah. There's this guy like in like it's not translated. It's just him in in Swiss yeah. shouting. But I think if you translate it, it's him saying like he's the he's the he's the bat like he, he's an alien. He's a shapeshifter wolf, alien. Wolf, 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 shapeshifter. Yeah. Don't do it. Yeah, as much as I knocked it, like it was good. Like I. I talk shit on the 80s movies or whatever, like these scary movies with these effects and all that. And it's only it's only because it's so obvious how shit it looks now. Yeah. Like, take me take me back to the first day Freddy came out and watch that shit. Like, I don't have anything to compare it to. I'm not like, well, you know, there's also that fucking Star Wars shit or fucking Avatar. Like, I, I can't compare it to that. It's just like, well. This is the newest shit I've seen now, so this is the best looking shit. Because I remember gloating about, ah, oh, motherfucking Super Mario Brothers looks so much more real than Pitfall on Atari. Like, and they both look like shit. But only because we now have a better comparison, you know? But, uh... Should we get into it? Yeah, let's get into it. So, so Night- yeah, uh, Nightmare on Elm Street, right? Disclaimer first. Go ahead. Spoilers. I watched it on my computer... Mm-hmm. Which my battery's dead, so if charger. my charger disconnects, the computer just turns off. Mm-hmm. And I got to, I had some not some good notes, but I was just writing w- what I thought. Mm-hmm. And I got to about because I decided to do it on, on my computer, not on my phone. Uh, yeah, were, I, were you going to bring the computer? No, I was going to copy paste it and, and email it like I did now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Rob's nodding his you head. Just write it down. The only downfall I have to writing it down is the fact that you hear. Fucking 
Paper. It's the, it's the only downfall. Oh, yeah, if you guys didn't catch that, that was paper. <laughs> well, no, I, I meant to look at the, the meter. But I to make um, sure it caught up. Yeah, I I and then the computer brought to you by paper. Paper, yeah. Uh my dog hit my cord out at around when Greta died, so I had I lost all my notes prior to Greta. But I I Is that I, only I, forty minutes in? I think so, yeah. Huh. It's only an hour and thirty minutes. They're they're all oddly an hour and twenty something an hour. Well, and because 30. it's it's in the eighties. Everything was oh, that then. was the runtime. Yeah, pretty much That's that was it. the average. Titanic was revolutionary when it went that long. Which one, Titanic? Titanic. Yes. You forgot. You forgot one or two of the T's. Watch out. So you were you were so basically, I am noseless, and I am just going to follow Rob's lead, and I'll jump in when I when I can until about when Greta dies. And this is where it gets fun because if you can't tell, Robert's memory sucks. Ooh. That's why you should write notes. You got to write notes. But you write say something on Nightmare on Elm Street. I got Enmos 5, Nightmare on Elm Street. En- Enmos. Good job. Thanks. Enmos 5, The Dream Child. I do remember a very blue sex scene uh, at the, the start. It starts off with a title screen that is 89 awesome. Not that good. Because it, it's just it's the way it opens. Like I've noticed, because I went back and watched the a handful of the rest of the series, they do not know how to choose music. Well, do you remember, I, I will get to it later, but that rap song that, that, that just came on uh, at the end, at the Freddy's end credits? Freddie's got a whole rap CD. Ooh, I believe BT it. BT dubs. I believe it. Freddie seems like he's, so yeah, so. He's probably Wes, a really cool guy no, that you can get to do no, fucking anything in Wes real life. Wes Craven made this creepy character, this like, you know, like, come on, like this guy get you in his dreams. He can do whatever he wants to, to you. Do you know where it was based out of? Oh, give me a sec. And then I feel like Ro- Robert England, who mm-hmm. when they did a, when they did a Freddy, after, after Wes Craven's left, or he was like, I'm not doing it. I feel mm-hmm. like they kind of you know, did a Kiss Army and kind of sold out a bit. Fred, like a Freddy TV show. There probably was, like a Freddy rap. You know what I mean? Like, 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 like he. He would have done anything just to trying be to Freddy. Make money. Yeah, which I cool. get it, but Wes Craven wasn't. He was just trying to make a creepy ass thing that'll haunt you forever. And he did. He made a he made a very creepy. I mean, he overdid it, but he made a very creepy movie. Well, then he did three. Well, then he did three, and then he came out for Wes Craven's new oh, nightmare. That's right. That's right. Yeah, so that's why it got bad at four and all that shit. Well, that's what they say. Yeah. Well, it did. It just it got real. It got real like stereotype, like bad, funny yeah. kind of shit. Yeah. Because, I mean, there was this couple things, like, I think in 3, there was a bunch of, like, popcorn noise. Because they were, it was all a pool party and shit. Yeah. And then there was just, like, things were blowing up, and it was just popcorn noises. And specifically, one of the things that were blowing up was, like, a plate of hot dogs. Mm Mm-hmm. So, they're just, the hot dogs just burst into flames, and then start flying off the board, like, like, exploding flying off the board. Yeah. uh, Without having any hot dog shrapnel. But every time a hot dog flew off the plate, it was pop, 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 pop. I was just like, whoa, whoa. this is popcorn. Those are hot dogs. This shit doesn't work. So it was just little things like that. That just didn't work. work? Oh, of course it didn't work. But so um, so you're right. There is there is a very blue, sexy opening. Yeah. Uh, a lot of sexiness going on in the series. Um, also, because a running gag. They're, they're keeping it well, it's hard R. You know yeah, what I mean? Got to be. Because then, like, that's how. Because if we can show tits, gritty teen romance, we can show a knife in the gut. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. like if we can show that, like, like I like. Would you rather, without knowing what what anything is on TV, would you rather have your if you're if you're sitting here with your five year old kid, would you rather him see not like a sex like not like a sex scene like a naked woman walking to the dish hour, uh. or would you rather see something sticking out of Freddy, all gory like? Do you want to see something natural uh, than a naked woman, or do you want to see something that, that's going to creep the shit out of them? Uh, five-year-olds? I know neither, but th- this is I like... Mean, like some shit that I would have to explain less of would be the shower. Yeah, so you could be and like, it's, oh, it's this still, isn't for you, time to go, kid. Yeah, it's still young enough to where I'm pretty sure like when, when he's probably seen mom come out the shower or like... Uh, 
Yeah. You know, I mean, not, not like mom's just like, oh, finally, out of the half of work, fucking tits out, eight o'clock. Jeez. Like, eight o'clock, no, but just. Out. But just like you know, this what is I mean? well after you, the sex scene. Like you, you got a small child in the house. Like you're not gonna lock the bathroom door, just in case. You know what I mean? But okay, we're, we've gone on to something much different. <laughs> I was asked. I was like, would you like, like? I think with the movie like this, if they just show tits and at the start, parents will know that. Oh, there's tits. Not not a movie. Not a movie for kids. Look, if you didn't fucking realize that. I mean, I get you. Well, it's on TV. You're like, what is this blue, blue? Is that a back? Is that a, I, I think I had in my notes. I can't tell what body parts. I these didn't are. know. It took I a, thought I saw a belly button. It took a while. But then it went to like the ass cheek. So I was like, does mm. she have a belly button on maybe, her back? Maybe it wasn't the ass cheek. Maybe it was the shoulder blade. Who, who knew? No. Yeah. It was very, you couldn't tell what was going on. I didn't know if that was part of the, the mysticism. Anyway, they they finish having sex and she just gets in the shower, right? Uh, yeah, and it is a devil shower because something starts coming from the the. Well, because she drain. has the shittiest shower head, one of those shower heads that seem 80, like dude eighty nine. Yo, but still, it's a shitty shower head. It's like it's like someone's peeing on you. It's that shower head, and then showering up, whatever, whatever. Ooh, we get that through the glass look. We get to see some. Uh, some pixelated chachers. Yeah, yeah. And then and then, and then what happened? Oh, and then the, the... The water comes from everywhere. No, 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 no. The bathtub starts throwing up brown. Yeah, which I was saying that... And then she puts her hand in it. You don't do that. Well, she's trying to stop it. My guess is it's probably shit, so you are correct. I wouldn't do that. I would get out, I would get out first mm-hmm. and kind of look at it for a while, see if it's still going mm-hmm. or if it's going to stop. You know what I mean? Like, if it's still coming, I'd be like, hmm. hmm. The right. first thing I wouldn't do would be, like, bend over and p- put my hand in it. Yeah. Even if I am in an 80s horror movie. Yeah, I mean, use your foot, like, wiggle it a little bit. Yeah. You're probably just trying to finish the shower, and if it's not, like, it wasn't spewing, but it was it was a gross. She didn't seem that upset by it. She was no, like, oh, look at that. probably happened before. That's probably, probably Freddie probably picked, picked and chose, like, oh, you or, know what, she's got bad plumbing. she's just so used to bad, yeah, the bad plumbing. Mm, yeah. Oh, right. is that my shit again? Oh, uh, poop. Uh, and, then, and then water and then comes from everywhere, yeah, right? Shower attacks. What bothered Which, me the most was just like that wouldn't you happen. got you got fucking water spewing out of the tiles. Like that's not even possible. So, I get it. This whole thing's not possible. Whatever. No, that's my, not possible. My big thing was that like it, have the tiles fly off. It and, wouldn't like, start seal in her. there. The water wouldn't because it seals in her little shower with the little. With oh the yeah, door that's impossible. Closed. Yeah, that is impossible. And like you think it filled it, okay, up quick as fuck so too. It, it's your dream. You have some control over it. Mm-hmm. Would you be like, that's not possible. <laughs> you got to wait. You got to wait for that moment because there was something said. I don't know if it was in this one or another one. I think it was the first one. But there's there comes a point that you can realistically like learn to control your dreams. Like that, like when the guy became his superhero alt- alter ego. Yeah, that horse shit. We'll get into that. Fucking, um, yeah, but you can, you can learn to control your dreams. You can control of his power. Yeah, but she doesn't know any better. Like, she has she already she, has she already been nightmared so before? Does, does that mean that she's? I think so, because she was in the fourth one. See, who's that? Who's that? That What's was it? Alice. That's that, Alice. That, that was Alice. Gotcha. So, so oh, that's right, because Alice uh, suppressed all this. Yes. Yes. So Alice turns out because this is what I kept doing. I kept writing down why is Alice asleep in the, the, the shower, and I kept doing other things like why is he asleep while doing this, and then it comes back to them waking up and then dying. Right. So then Alice fell asleep in bed, so she never took a shower. Do you know what I mean? Well, it keeps yeah, coming yeah, back. Yeah, no, yeah. but I keep thinking, it keeps tricking me. It keeps being like, why right. Why is she asleep here? Why is he asleep well, there? You know what? I found out maybe 10 minutes in, and I was just like, that's why she's having all the dreams everywhere. Because it wasn't making sense in the first place. What do you mean? Well, it wasn't making sense because it's like, okay, well, Freddy has to wait until you're dead or until you're asleep to start attacking. Yeah. But then we got uh, spoilers. Uh, then we got. I was like, why, why, why? Because she's then something happened. She's walking to work, but and I was like, oh god! As soon as they said pregnant, I was like, oh, there you go. There's there's the gun. Yeah. Well, I don't know if that's the gun. I no, think that's the gun. not the gun. I was trying to figure out what the gun was. Oh, uh, the gun was perhaps Jacob. No. The the rape scene. <laughs> 
because they because uh, the they because they rape scene because they 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 throw freddy back in there <laughs> oh yeah oh uh, fuck <laughs> no oh ooh, sorry i'm gonna edit, edit that out what? um so i'll see okay we'll talk about the movie and we'll see oh, yeah. if we can get to, to, to the gun mm. so she wakes up and she because she wakes up and then she she does a double wake and then mm. lying next to her was uh because she's screaming and then robert england's ne- next to her right not freddy was it Robert? It yeah, was a yeah, lunatic. Yeah, yeah. yeah, cause yeah, the crazy fuck. Oh wait, no. Sorry, 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 sorry. She fell in, fell through the, the shower naked, and yeah. was walking through the asylum right. naked, and then all of a sudden she was in nun clothes that said Amanda Kruger. Yes. Wait, was she Amanda Kruger? Yeah. Well, that's what her her name tag said. Uh-huh. Like it was her for a second. Oh, that's right. So she fell through. She got. She was walking through the motherfucking thing. I and called then, it an, uh, an asylum. Got, they, yeah, yeah, they I called I, it, I got it our, asylum. our religious order. Right. But then she got hemmed up by like some orderlies or whatever so and some got put dudes... on the table. And then she was like a no. fucked up labor thing. No. It was her. No. And then it flipped because it yeah. showed her. Yes. And then it did like a 180. No, you, you're, you're, so you missed the rape bit. So they, oh, oh, they're they sh- walking out. Sorry. Blah, 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 blah. So she falls through the, the shower in the inner dream, and she's this dude. I'm doing all this with no notes. I'm, I'm, you know. Yeah, but you also just watched it three hours ago. I did. I did. I did. Wait till we get forty minutes in. I'm gonna start lying to you about shit that happens. <laughs> so she's walking through, and then she realizes she's in her her nun clothes, mm-hmm. and then she sees a hundred, whole bunch of lunatics, and then there's the guards who are up top right. counting, and then the other guys like hurry up, and he's like ah I lost count, and he's like whatever <laughs> it's a hundred let's go fuck it. And then they don't see her, and then the lunatics see her, mm. and then you know, you know, because multiple sperm can make a child. <laughs> I get it. So then, demon child. and then it cuts to those orderly. No, shit. it cuts what to her cut watching to? it happen. Like she always, she's all of a sudden watching everything happen, and then she gets orderly and tied away and stuff, uh, and then okay. reverses again. She's watching yeah. Amanda Kruger give birth, and they're like, "It's a like." Like every child like is a gift from some, God. Yeah, some old horse shit. And she's like, no. Oh, but you know, I th- I think this is based over two dreams. But if we just get out of the way, that's fine too. I don't think it's based over two dreams. It's based over one dream. Well, yeah. Well, because isn't it like? Because I, I think, just woke up in I a think, dream. I think she she. I I keep I hate saying this word multiple times, but I think she gets raped and then wakes <laughs> up, and then when she wakes up, there's a lunatic beside her in her real bed and then yes. she wakes up next to Danny. Danny's her boyfriend's name. Right. Motorbike Danny. <laughs> Motorbike Danny. So uh oh god. Cuz she thinks she's like I'm having dreams where I have no control over them. Right. Like she's not saying Shut it's up, bitch. it's it's Freddy yet. Right. Yeah, cuz she's embarrassed about it. Yeah. And apparently Freddy's supposed to be gone cuz they destroyed him and What's somewhere. the name of the town? Springdale? Didn't tell you. Elm Street. Um. So, so that happens. So she wakes up. Where am I at? So it's graduation day. Then it just cuts to graduation day. Two exclamation points! Yay! And then uh, everyone's so nineties. I know it's eighty nine, and it's right there. But oh, everyone's yeah. everybody's so so happy. And it's like the castle so, blossom. It does look like the castle blossom, right? Yeah. And then uh, whatever they're all talking about graduating, whatever. And then then drunk dad shows up. Good old fashioned drunk dad. The drunk dad showed up. Mm-hmm. She didn't think he was rich. Show mom up. was there. Was rich mom? The rich mom was for the other one. That was for no. Gun- but Gun- I, I, I remember being like, I'm getting a lot about these characters. Really, qu-. like you know, I'm getting a lot of, li- like I yeah, don't know no, these like- names of these people, but I know these characters. Like I felt like over the limited amount of time, because I know that they're all gonna die. You know what I mean? Like yeah. it's one, it's one of those movies where I'm like, everyone's gonna die. But are they making me try to get as as attached as possible? I don't think so. They're like, they're... don't eat that. You need to save it for your body. Like, you better not yeah. eat shit because of your body. Really? Why do you always draw? Like, why do you always draw comic books? Do you like comic books so much? Uh, you hate blood. You know what I mean? Like, there's always like it's just little, like little micro lines, little quippets that add to their character that you don't really care about. Like, no. But then you're like, oh, she. No, Freddy's but making home, her... homeboy was trying to jump her bones real quick after a motorcycle accident. I suppose. Ooh, you suppose right. Um. So then, so yeah. What? So she's gonna go to Europe with this Danny He's guy. Gonna go, yeah, gonna go do some Paris Danny stuff. Wants, Danny has like a scholarship or something. 
Does he have a scholarship? Something like that. And yeah. his parents are like, you're, you're throwing your life away. You'll be dead in a couple of days. Yeah, it's... Yeah, this, this movie, it's just... It's so jumpy. Oh, like it I just figured goes, it out. I figured it out. Because... So it's graduation day, mm-hmm. they're all talking, and then there's a pool party coming up. Damn yeah, right, there's a pool party coming up. Have you noticed that her friend, who's the nurse, mm-hmm. is constantly like, "I have a shift later. I can't. Oh, I can't. Got a shift later. Yeah, can't. Oh, can't. Be Freddie. Got a shift. What do you uh, fan theory? I I thought she was on drugs. I thought she was going to oh, be yeah, out yeah. as like some meth addict. So, Alice, our protagonist, also has a shift in the diner that night. And then on her way to her car to work, she gets four she, hour lost. She walk. She walks through the park and she hears the kids sing the Freddie song. Mm-hmm. Now, the first thing I thought was this town has gone through four previous Freddie attacks. Yeah, you hear anyone singing that song? Mm-hmm. <laughs> you just start dumping on them, <laughs> like shot to the head. Oh yeah, double, double tap. Don't ever sing that. That should that should be. No. Was she singing it? No. There was these four kids in a playground. Right, that, yeah, maybe yeah, yeah. it was a dream, a sequence, because that's when we went. That's when we went back into right. Alice's because dream. that's what I was tripping. It's like I've never seen this shit. Why is she all of a sudden walking through a park and oh, dreaming? There's like, a Freddy she... song that, like, like, like. No, a I kid. knew. I know there was a Freddy song. Yeah. But I'm just trying to figure out, like, at this point in the time, without knowing it, the rest of it, it's just like, why is she dreaming? Like, this doesn't make any sense. Like, what am I missing yeah. in the Freddy Krueger mythos? So, Freddy, sorry. So she has she she goes back into Alice in into her dream, mm-hmm. and she sees Amanda giving birth to uh, every child's a gift from God, and she's like, "No, this is a demon gift kind of thing," you know, yeah. like. And then Freddy, little ugly Freddy was born. Yeah, well, baby Freddy. Ba- baby Freddy, and then like rat, like you know. Like kind of thing, like don't show it, but show the ends of it yeah, off he camera. Just scurried everywhere. Yeah, like like there's a guy just holding the other end of it, and once the camera hits him, he like. Da, 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 da. <laughs> uh, they get into a church, and then Freddie, you know, naturally, broke. so he's coming back through Alice, right? He's um. There was something about I I locked you away. He's like I found a key. Right. Well, that's the thing. That's what we don't we don't figure it out because it hasn't been revealed yet, but. That's what the key is, like, he found... Because he patted Amanda's belly, yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. his belly. Her belly. Somebody's got their belly pat, but that was the thing. He found out, like, when she got got pregged up, it was just like, ah, I can get you now, because... So, she got pregnant really fast, because she, they had sex. It was fucking blue screen. Blue screen's when she got pregged up. I didn't realize that either, until a while. I was like, when did they even fuck? And then I remember this this incoherent sex scene at the beginning of the movie. I was like, okay, that was them. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. So that's when no, she I, got I knew it was them. But it's, but Well, I didn't. But what's really weird is like, what are we talking, like a day later? Yeah. That, no, she had so a dream that so night. Fr- well, no, no, no. What I'm saying is like, she got knocked up that night, and we're talking about a day later, or that night, where he's like, oh, Seed's going to make it. Like, Freddy's back. It's uh, a boy. Uh, dang. <laughs> Oh, these one-liners. Yeah. These fucking horse shits. Uh, yeah, so then, you know, Freddy's back in full power. Yep. She, how did she yeah, end Did the, you, when he came back, like after he scurried away and got into the, the suit? Like full like full body? Yeah. Did yeah. you notice the wonky arm? What, what, what do you mean? Well, one of his arms was about three feet longer than the other. Yeah. It just looked bad. I didn't notice it. Oh, shit, it was so obvious. His arm is literally... There was, like, two elbows on one of his arm. Well, he's Freddy. He can do that. Yeah, but he, like, no. He you does... What's weird is he does it later on in the movie, like, when he gets his arm ripped yeah, off. Yeah, yeah, then yeah. Then he has wonky arm. So I didn't know why, like, his reincarnation would be automatic wonky arm. Very, very... Why is his reincarnation in human form? Why isn't he just, like, a giant snake or something? Because he crawled into the clothes. Yeah, he did. The magic clothes. And then, yeah, he came back... It's a boy, and then she runs off, and she runs into work, which I was like, where's the transition? Right there. No, but, like, normally it shows her waking up in her car, and she's mm. like, oh, I'm awake, but nope, she just walked, and they're I like, think, where were you? I think Freddy can just kind of control that. Like, if you kind of get out of earshot, you'll be fine. And then she she told her employee, like, her, her coworker, that, oh, Freddy's back, and she's like, I don't care. Like, shit. you're four hours late. I'm like... 
once again, you're in this. You're you're in Spring Spring whatever it is, Springdale, mm. and Freddie's back is said. You're like you're running. You're moving. Yeah. You're getting the fuck out none of, of there. These, none of these people are supposed to have any sort of common sense Epidemic. in these situations. This is a huge thing. Like you, you, you kill everyone connected to even remembering Freddie. <laughs> this is a virus. Well, I mean, it should be treated that way, but these are '80s kids, so they probably they, and '80s adults. They probably think that uh, that they can do it, and so they the serious rebellion. Then she calls her boyfriend, who has the reaction I I, I wanted. Yeah, well, because he knows. Yeah. Like, he was there before or whatever. He's there just answering the phone all topless and in jeans. Just yeah. like, hey, Ugh. man. You got the champagne. Oh, he did get the champagne. Now, here's my weird thing about that is, and I mean, I guess it's because you, at this point in, or at this era, like, you just know where your friends are hanging out. But did he work at that pool place? No. Is that why she called and was just, they're just no. like, we the know who that guy is. The nurse lady uh-huh. was on the swimming team. Mm-hmm. And she had to stay late for practice, mm-hmm. and they were like, "Oh, you can't party." He's like, "I get to stay late. That means coach gives me the keys to lock up." Oh, uh, pool party! Gotcha. Okay. Nineteen eighty-nine pool party. Nineteen ninety. Oh Jesus! And remember, then remember Britney Spears? No, the fuck would I remember that for? What did Britney Spears do? Like in the nineties? <laughs> what did she do? She had a pool party. No, I'm just trying to think of all the 90s things that I can think of. Remember Pogs? Was Britney Spears in the 90s? Late Mid 90s, late 90s. Oh, uh, yeah. I guess so. Pogs, I remember Pogs, but Pogs was like when I was in elementary school. NES. NES was 89 or 80s. Yeah, so it was around then. I still had one in the 90s. Ooh. <laughs> still probably still have one now. I do. Yeah, there it is. No, that's Super Nintendo. Yeah. Regular Nintendo's in the room. Um,. So she gets a hold of what's his name, Danny. De- Danny. Danny. Danny dead. Gets a hold of uh, dead Danny, and he's oh, don't forget the champagne, brother. What does he call it? He calls it uh, something, a secret ingredient or fucking comic book boy. Secret ingredient to poos. The poon. The poon, the poon juice. The poon tang. Um. Yeah. So oh, I gotta go. And then uh, he runs out and comic yeah, book. Yeah, I don't kids. care. Like, like, oh, I just graduated. I don't care. There's a. Yeah. Supernatural dream killing psychopath at free. But nobody else knows it's just Danny. I don't I guess I have to see four, three and two and one Ooh. to tell you how everyone forgot about him. <laughs> they don't. They push him down. Like push they they where? honestly they just push him down in their in their minds. In everyone's him, minds? Down. Oh yeah, everybody just pushes it down and but they have I think they have this um this medicine, this super like like dream suppressant, yeah. That they just pass out all willy nilly, and then once he's forgotten about, it, he's powerless. Yep. Hmm. Can't if the if nobody remembers him, then uh, he can't do anything. He has to become relevant. Yeah. Right? Is that him? He's, he has to be relevant. Yeah, yeah, no, no, he has to be. Yeah, Unlike yeah. Beetlejuice, yeah, he has to be trendy. Mm. He wouldn't last nowadays with all the different trends on. Oh, no, no, no. Too many trends. Spaghetti monsters, all this shit. What's well, a hipster? Who <laughs> fucking knife fingers. Uh, it's, this movie's bad. No, it's not, I don't think it was that bad. I think it held up. Uh, so Danny's yeah. going to go save his girlfriend. And and yeah. once I remember when he was driving, once you saw him not off once, I'm like, dead. He's dead. Well, he, did, he started in a truck. So, yeah, he started in a truck. And then he got truck tacked. And then he got truck tacked, yeah. The, um, the Freddy fused the truck with him. And then for some reason, tore off his hand, his arm, put his arm on the truck to hold him. And then spat out wine. Uh, he, he drank the champagne and went, good year. And then like oh, yeah, acid all Fuck over it. the place. Okay, so this is my note, all, all in succession. Oh, oh! There's a funky bass while he's driving. By the way, oh yeah, a really cool funky bass. So, attack by seatbelt. Dead Freddy, joke about wine. Tree explodes or tire explodes. Did you, did you notice that? Yeah. After he was attacked, like his his tire blew up, like it was full of gasoline, oh. and shrapnel everywhere. Also a dream. Yeah, but it's I don't know. I I just like some of these things. So and then uh. Okay, and then what happens? So then he gets, he's 
attacked by seatbelts and he's restrained. Yeah. Heavily by yeah. seatbelts. And then gets thrown from the car. Well, if they're self straining, they can let go at the same time too. I don't know. I, I mean, I again, like we can revert back to, oh, it's a dream. But what is that like? It's the easiest answer to give in the Freddy what film. The oh, fuck? it's a dream. Well, we can't do that. Like you have to find a logical reason. Like there has to be some sort of basis to reality in this shit. No, that's the thing. There, there isn't because he gets, he gets smashed through. The window, which ends up being the window into the diner where she works. Mm-hmm. And then he gets on a motorbike to keep going. No, he doesn't get smashed into the diner. Oh, he gets into the he pool? He gets smashed into the pool. Yeah, okay, he ends okay. up back at the pool. Sorry, some I, I, for reason. some reason I had diner in my head. No, no, because that's he does. He ends up, oh, no, he doesn't make oh, it to the he, diner. He, uh, but he, he gets on a motorbike instead. Right. And then he unf- then Freddy fuses the motorbike to his body, which I thought was some pretty good effects. It kinda... was a pretty good fucking idea, but they went. They took that... it. They took it too far, and they fused him too far into that bike. Oh, you, you think it should have just been his hands? Yeah, and just stuff? Yeah, get his hands so you can control him. Like you don't need to turn his chest into a cassette player or whatever the fuck they did. Too far. Oh, it's too far. I I think the way it holds up is that it would, how I put it in the hold up a meter, mm. that it would freak out a kid. A kid yes. wouldn't think it was fake. It'd be like, oh no, uh, well, yeah, uh. yeah. But it, I mean, kids aren't supposed to be watching this shit. No, but it's just it's at that level. So, it, so yeah. ad- adults are like, oh, I see how they did that, but oh, yeah. And then what? What, what did Freddie say? Oh, who no, he said every, he said everything. Oh, Danny, I uh, don't you know you're not you're not meant to bleed and drive. <laughs> and then then oh, uh, and then he did say so that. he was drive he drove him into a truck, but then he woke up in his car just before he hit the truck. Oh, yes, that's right. And, and then, well, I was waiting for him to crash that whole fucking time because they got him going like a hundred and something miles an hour. In his dream. In the dream. And then, yeah, it was wake up. In reality, it's just probably like 40. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he was in reverse. Yeah. Yeah. And then, yeah, he just wakes up and he's like, oh. And then. So she so she, she hears a crash. What's and the he fuck got, hears the crash? He got close. Yeah. She, she hears the crash. And she's not. A half a step out that door before she's like, oh, I know who it is. Because he, she can. Cons- he didn't see any of it. No, but she did. She, she saw. She didn't. She saw after Danny she, die. After she started running towards the thing. No, no, he didn't see. No, wait, wait, hold up. She, she didn't knew see that the there incident. was a, No, she did not. You're right. She had to run way up before she could see Danny. And then he, he said some horse shit before he died. Wait for him to finish so I can. So instead of interrupting him. I can tell him the point how he's wrong after he finishes. No, because she wasn't fucking close enough to see if it was him or not until she ran to the car. Are you finished? What happened? So, she is connected to each death. So, because Freddie is coming from whatever, the baby, her. Yeah. So, she was in the diner, ready to go, and then she saw Danny in his fused biker form Get sucked into whatever hell or whatever the portal was. Oh. So she knew that something happened to Danny. She was confused because it was the first death. And then she ran out and saw the car crash. Like, not see the car. Saw the results of a car crash. The truck on the car on fire. The mm-hmm. guy in the truck covered. He came out of nowhere. Like, right, right. Like, shut up. Um, Really? She saw him on a bike? Yeah, because the same thing happens every. So she witnesses it every death. Pretty much, because she was... I remember him saying some shit about that, but I yeah, didn't fucking... Yeah, because the death's connected through her. Freddie's connected through her. Oh, so that's why she saw What's-Her-Name come out of the fucking fridge? Yeah. Oh, that's stupid. I know. Yeah, it was... I thought, thought it was... I mean, that made more sense than her fucking seeing Robocop on the bike. I I was thinking more Mad Max. Oh, uh, yeah. Right, yeah. I haven't yeah. seen that one either. Uh, any of them? No. Not even the new one. I'd say... I'd say... Go for the new one first, and then yeah. if you like the idea of it, go back. I don't. Um, <laughs> so yeah, he and then and then for some reason, Freddy possesses him for a hot second. Hot, hot oh, he's burning, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, and he's like, "Hey, let's make a baby." Uh, and like, yeah, that's a weird choice of words, like because I'm pretty sure Robert England is just going improv by now. Uh, yeah, so I mean, he probably this one, and then is there six? Uh, there's six of them, yes. At least. What's like six in whatever run this is? 
What do you mean? Oh, like so in what, like the before actual before a new nightmare and um, let me see. Uh, oops, wrong one, wrong fucking mouse. Let's see, let's see. Just go to Robert England, and then he'll be able to. Oh, well played. Or just the franchise. Is this the franchise? It's not the franchise. I don't remember shit. But I think there's six, and then Wes Craven's New Nightmare, and then God damn it, A Nightmare on Elm Street, and then Freddy. All right, and then um, Freddy versus Jason. Is that? What are you doing? Oh, you just got lost is what oh, I was I doing. I forgot how to use the internet. I did. I totally forgot. I, sh- I should have just typed in fucking Nightmare 6 and see what happens. It's like the Where f- the fuck are we at? Writer's credits? Because you're in Wes Craven. Yeah, I know, but it would have fucking... Wes Craven... No. D- d- God, Jesus Christ. I, we, we already said this. I know that. It's been a long day. You want to go to Robert England? He's been in every single one. He dropped out after a while. He's not. He he's been in every one except for A Nightmare on Elm Street. The very first one? No, uh, the remake with the guy who played Rorschach in. Um. Oh, the guy who was supposed to have the part that Johnny Depp got. Really? Yeah. Apparently, one of them went in, and Johnny. They were just like, "Yeah, come on, Johnny Depp, fucking come with me." And then, um. They were just like, well, instead of you doing it, uh, why doesn't that guy do oh, it? Oh, he's Scarecrow in Injustice 2. Is no, it? That's, that, that's kind of cool. Interesting. Oh, is this going? Oh, this is reverse chronological order. Okay, that's why. So, that, that's two, three, five. Or five, and then Freddy's Final dead, Nightmare? The final Nightmare, ni- 91. Up. Oh. Okay. As Freddy Krueger, yeah, Nightmare Cafe, the TV series. Uh, he's 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 Blackie. Oh, don't you start this so he, shit with me! And Wes Craven's new nightmare, yeah, because that's when Freddy right. Freddy is in the real world. All right, and then, and then Walker, Freddy versus Jason, I think. Walker Tex- Texas Ranger, married with children, huh? Oh, he's Lucifer. Look at that The Simpsons, Freddy Krueger and that's The right. Simpsons. Uh, let's see. Freddy vs. Jason. Way in in Las Vegas. Oh, it's... And then Freddy vs. Jason. Yeah, that's some... They had a way in in Vegas? That's some kind of... It's publicity, obviously. Yeah, and it's that sounds fun. I'd I'd go to that. Uh, You know what I mean? That sounds fun. It probably costs so much. It probably costs a whole shitload. See? Oh, that looks bad. Look at him. And Michael Buffer. Oh, yeah, Michael Buffer's the Let's Get Ready to Rumble guy. I guess. I mean, it's campy. We're looking at a... Uh, with a... Freddy, you got to come out to Vegas, man. You got to do a weigh-in. Mm. Quizno subs is fucking... Mmm, <laughs> toasty. Mmm, <laughs> toasty. Oh, oh, you see what they did there? Mmm, toasty. Yeah. Uh, We got sidetracked. Where are we in the movie? We got hell sidetracked. Oh, so, yeah, uh, so... So, yeah, yeah, homeboy blew up, let's have a baby. And now, now, now she's at, now she's at the hospital. Oh, because she faints. She faints, and this is where we find out for sure that she's pregnant. No, she's just a little pregnant. Or just a little pregnant. Remember, she's like, there's there's nothing wrong with you. You're Just, just a little pregnant. Just a little pregnant. And then here we go from the rest of the movie, no matter what happens to her, no matter... When she's explaining how fucking terrible these dreams are and everything, they're just like, guys, it's she's got her some slack. She's pregnant. She's having delusions. Like, but the, even the doctor told her, like, oh, you know, new pregnant people they get a little bit delirious and like they lose their mind a little bit. It's like, no. Like, I'm sure things happen, but they just don't start making up burnt motherfuckers with knife fingers, like trying that, to kill, that like have. Plenty of Come evidence on. of their existence, which Mark found. Remember, Mark had all the paper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which, which like, if I okay, let's say oh, I this pregnant bitch has gone so crazy. So let's say I had some kind of illness, and I came to you, and I had like, oh, there's a there's a serial killer running around. And you're like, ah, that's just the flu you got. I'm like, no, look, this guy's actually real. I'm no, I saw him. He's real in your diarrhea would you, dreams, would, man. Would you take it a little bit seriously if there was proof around it? Not like this isn't a supernatural guy yet. I haven't gotten there yet. <laughs> 
I wouldn't believe it. Mm. If I even if I knew you had the flu, I'd just be like, he's got the flu. I'm gonna call your girlfriend. Let her know. Hey, That's, Matt's tripping again. Matt's it must tripping. be the he flu. Has, he has he has the, the flu. I always thought that because you know those he's people drip, in movies cough. who are like, you're crazy. Like you know, like mm-hmm. after the the monster ha- has been established, right. And then there's always like, you're crazy. That That's not happening. And then they get killed by the, the, the monster. How long would it take me to believe someone that there's something attacking them? That you just Kruger-esque core shit's happening? Yeah. You know what? Because I, I Mark, this... Mark fell asleep and woke up with scars. Yeah. So it took Mark proof. Like, what right. Just and then he bought into it. Yeah. You see, I, I posed this question to Jeff years ago. So... We're just like a monster from like a monster movie. Like well, I was a, gonna say this. So let's say somebody put really good zombie makeup on. Okay. And we're we're back at seven ten. We're working there. Okay. And it's just a slow day. Not a lot of shit happening. But then right there, right in front of the pier, you just get like this little zombie comes out and just starts kind of limp limp legging everywhere and just like do like selling the shit out of it. Like, is it bothering people? Like, is it not yet? It hasn't gotten there. He but he's just like slow. <sighs> Okay. It looks looks legit. Okay. Looks fucking legit. Okay. With all of our knowledge on all this shit, how long does it take before somebody shoots him? So what I'm afraid and of... And he's going to get shot now. He's going to get shot in the head, most likely, right? Yes. So... What do you mean? Hear me out here. So movies like and social media have told us what zombies are. Right. That to kill a zombie, you got to shoot in the head... They're they're the Walking Dead. What if there's a virus that gets sent out to the humans mm-hmm. and to to the humans to us humans, right? And that they have zom- they slow down, they they get all pale and they start walking. I was like, zombies, the hedgehog. Like, no, look, we got a cure. We're like, we can fix them. Like, we don't have a cure though. No, 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 no. But like, are people automatically like, you don't like root beer? I don't, but I have some. Are but like. Like it's what I'm afraid stiff. is that something's gonna I have to be careful. Something's gonna happen. Like Sorry, if something's gonna happen, what makes him so so sure that it's a zombie? Like like cuz zombies don't okay, like first off, zombies don't exist. So if something's Some showing zombie yes. if something's sh- showing zombie symptoms, uh-huh. then People automatically like it's a zombie. Like yeah. it's it's a Walking Dead. Like what if it's just something that has a virus that has zombie symptoms? There's nothing that has zombie symptoms. How do, like that's not even been invented yet. You know what I mean? Like that's why we wouldn't be like, oh, it's that weird zombie thing that I heard about on. Yeah, no, no, no. But then people would kill it right away and be like, no, there's an easy cure. But I'm afraid that too many people would die from people just being like zombie. Like, 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 like someone has a broom, breaks the broom and stabs. But, but now uh, let's, let's be realistic now because we also have those weird like bath salt into the incidents and the, uh, not lean, but there's uh waka flocka or waka that's been going around where people go nuts and get all zombie esque. Start chewing oh, on people. That whole fucking whatever drug. Yeah. It's called waka. That, uh, oh man, that I t- like, okay. I, so have, do you do you no, have you see seen this happening? Those, do you, and you're you working the door. Video? Do you go try to find out what's wrong with that person, or are you just like eh, somebody's on their own? Well, in this day of age, unfortunately, it, a social media has made it to a point where like someone's filming this, and this isn't a zo- like this is just a guy trying to get a public right. Yeah, yeah. So I'm not gonna. Well, I'll be like, hey, I'll probably not realistically. I'll be like, hey, that's funny. But if he tries to come in the bar, I'm like, you have your ID, mate. <laughs> like, right. Uh, he's walking, and somebody crosses his path, and you see him reach for it. Yeah, because he's gonna freak him out. But when when do when do you buy into it? When he attacks him, there has to be bloodshed. No, just an just an attack. But then you'll I, go. I, if you'll I see someone attacking someone, I'm gonna do. Uh, I think I might. I think I might do something. I'm pretty if sure. If it's a zombie looking thing. Yeah. Really? I wouldn't touch it. You so if a zombie's attacking me, you just. Sorry, bud. It uh, depends. What? What? I mean, if I don't, if I can't really 100% make it, like, if we're just sitting here right now and all of a sudden a zombie starts attacking you, then yeah, I'm going to have a little something to no, do with you're, it. No, you're in, you're at the 710 kitchen, uh-huh. you hear a bit of you're talking commotion, to, you're across and the street I'm on, talking I'm, to I'm on, I'm on the floor with 
holding the zombie arms back, and I'm like, mm-hmm. Rob, help me! Oh, well, I mean, if you're fending him off, and there's a fair chance of me and you I know this looks like a joke, but it's not, and I don't know what I can continue to keep saying to make you believe it. Yeah, that would be, uh, that verbal selling point would be really difficult. Like, you it would, would keep, have like, to, shoving it, and then it just keep like, going from, like... I think, then and, and let's just make this a fair note so we know, and then we'll get back to the movie. If this ever happens, what I need you to do is I need you to figure out how to put your your hand or your foot through this zombie. Because if I can see one of your limbs going through this carcass or ripping an arm what off... What if it's a... Okay, wait. I will buy so, into it. So, so that's an old zombie. That's a zombie that's been a zombie. That's a body that's been a zombie for a while. Right. What, what if this is like the 28 days later... You're going to have a real hard time rage. selling it no, to me. No, but this is the rage virus in 20, in, in 20 days later where people just... Are on X, like sorry, not X, are on speed, and they're running like crazy, oh. and they're still solid. Yeah, yeah. The chances not, are like, I would be dead rotting. before you. Then, huh? Chances are I'd be dead before you. No, but I meant like this is one out of like it hasn't spread yet. There's one person. This is Grand Zero, and he's gone for me because I'm I'm the closest. You know what I mean? Dope. Like, um, I don't know what I would do. I don't I don't know how we could be like. Look, I'm not kidding. Like this son of a bitch. No, we should just make up a word now. Okay. Um, that only that we can only use in case of a zombie apocalypse. Uh, Good God! Paint peanut butter and tomatoes. This is basically a word I will never say. It would have to be something dumb, like but which is fucked up because the only reason I say peanut butter and tomatoes is because today at work I told somebody I made a peanut butter and tomato sandwich. I didn't do it, but I was it was on my mind. Like, what if somebody ordered a peanut butter sandwich but they wanted a bunch of vegetables on it? It'd be a weird. Weird thing. Just make reference to this pod. Rob, remember that time we had that podcast and we talked about a word for for if if the zombie's real, but I forgot about the word and something about peanut butter and tomatoes. <laughs> it, yeah. th- this is it. <laughs> like, yeah, that would work if if we did that. That would, yeah, yeah, I like that. Fair enough. All okay. right, <laughs> definitely. Yeah, definitely. Okay, so where are we? So where what, are we at? Does yeah. that does peanut that butter. cover everything or just zombies? Uh, hey Rob, remember we talked about that 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 podcast? Well, wait, like, wait, wait, mean, wait, 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 just, just hold up. If this works, hey Rob, do you remember when we talked about that podcast about zombies attacking us and that uh, that if they if they're real, you wouldn't believe it? So I had to say peanut butter and tomato sandwich, and you're like, yeah. Well, Freddy Krueger's after me. <laughs> mm, <laughs> did, did, like, would, do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. Well, not Freddy Krueger, but well, there's a right. well, aliens are in my house. Mm, yeah. You know what I that mean? Would, that would work. That would definitely work. I mean, there would be some things like... But I mean, every... Like, is this covering anything? It like, does cover anything. Like, now, Frankenstein would be a weird thing because Frankenstein would stand out more. Like, not a lot of people are doing good Frankenstein. No, but you haven't seen it yet. It's in the other side. Like, we're here. It's uh, it's in oh, your back. Like, you know you, what I mean? You I'm like, just ran in here. Yeah. <laughs> Remember the podcast? <laughs> Then, then yeah, yeah. Then this we is can, our new yeah. way of. Then we can arm uh, ourselves. This is our new way of saying, uh, of saying like, serious. Rob, do you remember the podcast when we talked blah 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 blah? Mm. Well, my like my mother in law is here. And you're like I'm on it. Like you know, like like you just start killing her. I'm like no, I meant like distract <laughs> oh, her. Just while let I, you know she's here. Like, oh, like, oh oh oh! I thought she like, thought she was a thing. Again, snap a brew and just stab <laughs> in the head. I'm like no no no! I meant like I got her. I meant oh. like I needed I I needed to distract her for a sec while I go get my annoying cousins who don't get along sitcom style kind of thing. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So in that instance, we would just have to specify a little bit better. But yes, I do believe that this could be the the universal. I ain't fucking with you. Fair enough. Fair like enough. I'm, I ain't glad, fucking I'm glad we figured that out. Fair enough. I ain't fucking okay. So back to the movie. What just happened? Um, uh, I think Freddie. No, she's pregnant. Exact, yeah, now she's pregnant and everything's okay because she's pregnant and doesn't matter. And then we meet Jacob. Oh well, yeah, that's right. Jacob comes through and he says some old weird shit. Who is he? Because he's from somewhere. Oh, you mean the actor? Yes. Uh, let me pull up. Or do you want to pull up? No, I can try again. Maybe I can I'll, redeem I'll myself. I'll talk about Wrong this mouse. scene r- 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 real quick. Uh huh. So she's in. Yeah, she wakes up. Which I'm like, she just passed out. Why didn't she have a dream? It she there was no dream. She went, she passed out, and then she woke up. Mm-hmm. I was very curious on why there was no dream. This was the dream, wasn't it? Huh? This was the dream. No, Jacob. Freddy. Jacob was the dream. No, because she talked to what's her name. She talked to her nurse friend afterwards. No, b- before. She talked to her before and after. 
But but, but didn't she wasn't she talking to her then she then all of a sudden like nothing was going on and she talked to Jacob and then she no cuz it was at school. Or yeah, they were at school or some after, shit. After after yeah. Afterwards and she's like, "Yeah, met fucking Jacob." And she's like, "What the fuck you're talking about?" From the Yeah, from, from the from the kids, the the kids fucking ward. She, no fucking kids. We so don't. We, do, we, we don't have a kid's word. What do you mean to do? And then she's board. like, could you keep this dream thing on the DL? Yeah, and she's like, yeah. You shut Next up about scene. this shit. Freddy Krueger is real and he's attacking our dreams. <laughs> like, she's right? having like a meeting and oh, she's yeah. like, holy shit, everybody. It's, like, it's not real. She's just pregnant. Ooh, sorry about that. I, 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 I just you looked peaked. at That's the... okay. That's why, that's why I'm working on that noise cancer. Look, he looks like, you know, he looks like uh, Whit Hetford. Plays Jacob, apparently. He, in this picture on IMDb, looks like he could definitely play somebody from the Munsters. Doesn't he just look like a Munster? I suppose. What else has he been in? The Munsters? Jurassic Park. Oh, he was the little shit kid with the belly rip open. That's where I know him from. So, eh, so a giant chicken's gonna fucking grab my ding dong or whatever the fuck he says? Yeah. Yeah, 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 that kid. I knew his little fucking bag eyes looked familiar. In there, uh, I think there was meant to be a th- a theory that he was Uh-oh. that 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 kid grew up to be Chris Pratt in Jurassic World. Yes, I heard about that before Jurassic World came out. I believe. I thought that was kind of funny. A little clever, and then it was immediately shot down. Uh, I was never fat. Don't you ever say that? <laughs> he was never a fatty. He's a voice in Tiny Toon Adventures, the Ben Stiller show. Did you ever watch that? No. The creepy kid. You know, we're getting very sad. Mikey? Do you remember Mikey? No. That movie Mikey. Uh, he fucking kills everybody with like a baseball bat or some horse shit. So she wakes up in... in uh, so yeah, so the <laughs> next day in school after she told to keep the dreams on the DL. Yep, she can't do We it. have our introduction to what happened. Like, you know, the whole movie is just showing you, but she's like... So there was this asylum in the 40s and Amanda Kruger got raped by a bunch of lunatics yep. and then she gave birth to that baby and I'm like, that's not how semen works. It's one person's child. They, Unless they all gathered together and made a semen pact and just said, look, guys. No, I'm sure multiple... Uh, I don't really don't want to get into this. I'm sure there might have been multiple semen in, in the area. There's this particular name. But it only needs it only needs one what? one sperm to yeah. get in to there, the there's egg. There's a, a particular name for it. Theoretically, it's one person's child. Right, right, right. But you can't have this weird double double embryo thing. I believe it's recorded. So she gives so, and then she's basically saying that Freddy, you know, and then he killed a whole. He killed like twenty or thirty kids. And then he got off. On, you know, he did, they did the let me tell you about Freddy real quick. Right, right, right. Got, got, got off on a technicality. The parents tortured and killed him. Then mm. he came back in their dreams and killed, tortured the kids. Right. In a right. nutshell. Yeah, yeah. But think about this. Thinking side quest. Ooh. So, Freddy is fathered by a hundred dads. Yeah. How's Christmas? Pretty good? You think it's a good outcome? So you think these lunatics are like lining up? Aha, you knew where it was going. So it's not a good 100 dad Christmas. You now have 100 possibly shitty gifts from these lunatics. 100 shitty gifts better than no gifts. Uh, 100 people love you enough to buy you a gift. Now they're in the same time. So let, let's think about it. What's he, he's one of the things is probably literally going to be some poop. One of these people has to be off their rocker so bad that... But you're, that might not even be the worst gift. You're saying the idea is that Amanda Kruger took Freddie back to... Time to go play with... You know, like, it's your dad's weekend, and then like he gets tossed again. Think about tossed that. tossed into the crowd. Think about that. Your dad's weekend. There's 100 fathers. It's only 52 weeks in a month in a year. Yeah. She would only see him once every two and some odd years. No, he has she, she has him every week. It's the dad's weekend. No, the dad's dad gets every weekend. Yeah. There's a hundred weekends to get him. But how many? But what about Monday to Friday or Monday to Thursday or whatever? Good call. Good call. 
I was so just I was thinking for the week. You're just counting weekends. Just huh? counting. Yeah, yeah, I was just going weekends. You're right. So you're right. It goes Friday evening, Saturday, Sunday, back to Friday evening. Yes. Uh, in, your fa- in your fantasy world, I guess. Well, no, I didn't think it through. But that would be really weird because then there would still be no bonding time with any of them. No, no, he, no. He would get two and a half days. Wait, which one are you? Wait, who, are you the one who she was circle jerking, oh, or are you the one who <laughs> did you, you put your dick in her hand, or did you actually? Or did where you did do you one start? Of those, were you in the elbow? Did you wear a mask or don't? No. No, or, or, were you, oh, you were armpit number two. Oh, 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 you were the guy wearing the the one croc. Oh, I don't want to get into this. <laughs> uh, so, blah, 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 blah. yeah, Hulu. and then still no one believes her. No, and nobody's then, ever going to believe her. Greta, the rich one whose mom is like, don't eat that. You'll get fat. You got to look perfect always. Mm-hmm. Time for your beauty sleep kind of girl. Mm-hmm. You know, like, oh, like, yeah, she was very, I thought, um. I thought the boyfriend was like the, the big. Uh, no, that's in the first one. That the boyfriend's the. Uh, go ahead. Yeah, uh, she was. Yeah, because I remember when that scene happened when they were all at dinner. Yeah. I was just like, "What? Who? When the fuck did she become rich? This doesn't make any goddamn sense." Yeah. But then it was like, well, "Oh, okay, so, so yeah, you're she, the rich one." I th- like I, I like I think I had it in my notes. Like um, uh. Greta says, well, if anything supernatural or natural is coming after you, they're going to have to get through us. I was like, oh, <laughs> yes, I recall hearing that, too. And I was just like, well, way to bury the lead. Way to, way to mm-hmm. like, you know, foreshadow the shit out of this. Oh, yeah. Definitely. What happened after that? Then where are we now? Did did that just go straight to the uh, straight to the dinner scene? Let's see. No, because. Uh, crap, Troy. Oh. Um. Yeah, yeah, so, uh, Fred's mom was raped by the six. Everyone writes this Freddy shit off as, it's cool, she's just pregnant. So that's during that conversation. Yeah. Then, she's talking to her dad. Her dad comes home with groceries or some horse shit, I believe. And then she's just like, oh, are you... Oh, when did you become a, such a savvy shopper? Well, uh, fucking daughter's going to have a baby, so did it, and then it's whatever. And she's like, oh, you're not disappointed in me? No, not at all. Just don't make it a habit. Oh. Make a what a habit? Getting pregnant? Like, is that just a habitual thing? Like, are you... Her boyfriend... I mean, I get it. Her boyfriend is dead. Like, you yeah, know like, what I mean? Like... He's dead. He... The father, Don't get carried away. The father of her child. Don't turn into a lunatic. The father of his grandchild is dead. Yeah. And she's and he's like, make a habit. Don't make a habit. Gotta get him pregnant and killing your boyfriend. So, okay, so that happens. And then from there, it cuts straight to a crappy rich party. Yes. Turns fucked. So Super she, food eating. Die, bitch, die on the fridge. Yes, so let's let's do That's a quick. Weird. Let me do a quick summary of what happened. That you know, you did a great job there. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> yeah, I mean that that was a short and sweet of it. So but she, things happen. So this Greta one's at the party, and it's like a big fancy ass party, and she super and, fancy. And the basically the mom is super. Greta, get your beauty sleep. You need it, or don't forget you can't eat that because you're having like a photographer later, or you know yeah. you're you're a model. Just some hoity toity. Just. Every stereotypical, because I think the scene started with her being like, like, oh, people think we're sisters all the time, like oh, yeah. twins or, or something. And I'm and like, yeah, 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 yeah. To I, herself. I know this, this TV mom. I know her well. I've seen you before. Um, So then, so she... She falls asleep because she hasn't slept much because her because like she's like one of her mom's friends was like why don't you uh uh I know a guy over in Ford who will get you a modeling job yeah and then she's like look at you <laughs> is that what she fell asleep at the dinner table she fell yeah she kind of nodded off a bit ah uh, and then I was wondering how they got there and then Chef Kruger shows up oh uh, Chef EK which is one of the so basically Chef sorry Freddy Kruger in that Chef outfit yeah is one of the biggest images used to show how far freddy's gone you know from like the bathtub scene from the guy crawling with the veins 
Yeah. Have you seen that one? You know, yeah, that one, like was, really, that was four. From like really original. No, that was three. Really original, scary images to uh, just like, oh, bon appetit. Like, you know, yeah. like, like. And if you look closely at his joke fingers. Deaths. Like, you'll notice two of his fingers have have a spoon attached to them. So it's yeah. not just him. Well, because I thought it was just like he skewered it with his fucking knife hand. Uh, yeah. And then was like, eat it. And I was like, don't shoot, eat it to a feeder like that. That she's going to fucking die. Like, you're going to cut her face off. But Teddy then cares. in a couple of his shots, like, it shows, and it's, like, his two fingers, and there's just, like, a spoon head just, like, resting in there. And I'm just like, what is that? I don't know what she's eating, though. Uh, she's, I thought she was, like, eating herself. Like, yeah. she's eating, yeah, she's eating, like, bloody body. Something. Yeah. But, so, she, she, uh, and then she gets, like, that, that, that face makeup that is just... Her ch- her chipmunk cheats with the circle as a mouth. Yeah, it looks like a fucking garbage pail kid. Now you remember if, those? I think so. The garbage yeah, pail yeah, kid. Yeah. They were they were like cabbage patch kids, but like gross and like it was like Booger McGee, and he just had like snots <laughs> everywhere. I like. I was thinking that if I looked at her long enough, it would look bad. But because they do it so quick, and her and maybe getting stuffed with food. Yeah, it's done in good taste. And then because Alice needs to see every death or needs is needs to be involved in it or can sense it, right. she goes to her fridge and she opens it and all the food starts to rot and then Greta pops Which out. That was bad. You think? It looked like it made sense, but it, it looked real bad, obviously, because of the comparisons now, but it just... But Freddy's very... And then he like, grabs her and pulls her and Freddy's very fast with his grabbing. I always thought that... He's quick with the grabbing. Because That's I always fact. like, is that real or is that fake? Like, is, is Robert England pulling this actress in as fast as he can? Like, has that ever messed up? Um. Well, there's a complaint. Like, there's there's complaints throughout the series on how... how bad Freddy is at killing people. Because it's like, it's not even like he's toying with him because he keeps telling him, like, I'm going to get you. Like, I'm going to fuck with you. Like, I'm going to kill you. But then um, he just like lollygags everywhere. Yeah. He just like skips around like a little f- fucking ass hat. <laughs> and it's like he can't catch any of them to fucking save his life. Like, okay, but I get it in this one. Like, I, I, I just realized like he can't just straight up kill her because she needs fucking, ja- he needs Jacob to be born, right? Yes. In order to whatever, which doesn't make sense because if Jacob's born, then he can't just haunt this bitch all the time. So it's funny that um, I ju- I just remembered. So once, once Greta's freaking out, she's calling for. Sorry, once Alice is freaking out about Greta, she's calling for her dad, and she's like, "Help, help! Greta's in the fridge!" And then dies, and then she opens the fridge, and it's the fridge again. Right. All you hear in the background is Alice. Is dinner ready yet? Like. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I recall that too. That. I had a good chuckle with that one. Indeed. Uh, See, kind of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a better one that I'm thinking of, but I. This is the first one that popped up. See, instead of Richie Rich, it's Richie Wretch. Oh. See? See what they did there? They did. They do it. I'm on all of them. Harry Mary. I don't know if it rhymes, I guess. Dead Ted? Dead Ted. Good old Dead Ted. I don't know. What that, Ariel Ariel? That's stupid. They must have fell off at some point. But, yeah. So, Garbage Bill Kids. Um, Yeah, he's like... But see now this is the weird thing. Now this is this is like a, a Brian family guy, Stewie family guy kind of thing to where when these things happen is she, and she's even though she's not dreaming like nobody else sees this shit, like nobody else catches on to it. Yeah. So obviously they're not seeing the fridge scene. Well, it's not but when actually she like jump scares and all this like ah, nobody catches that like hey why it's Why in, are you freaking it's in out? Her, is it because you're pregnant? Because it's in... It's in... Because they're in a connecting dream. So it's almost like a hallucination. Right. But she's reacting in, in real time. Yeah. So therefore, like if she was in the kitchen right now and this shit happened, we would hear her... <gasps> or no. Well, he was watching TV. So maybe. Well, I mean, let's just say... Well, obviously, maybe we're not she'd watching she'd just TV. be standing there with her eyes closed going... <laughs> Just like a Rich. dog, like a dreaming dog. Rich. My dog t- 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 today, while I was watching it, was lying on her side and uh. just, and I was like, side, like, like not barking, kind of, kind of crying. I was like, are you okay, side? And then, 
blah, and just vomited, just like oh, a really? mite, just, just like a mite's full. No. And then it was like, hey, wait, hey, what's up? Like she wasn't even bothered by it. She was she like, sleeping? Yeah. And it just like she threw up in her sleep. I think she woke up for a sec and I went blah. Just, uh, Very like chunky, so it wasn't like it was uh, like a disgusting one. She's yeah, getting dogs, fixed on dog throwing up is really weird. She's getting fixed on Tuesday. Tuesday, yeah. Monday. Sorry, Wednesday. Wednesday. Two days from now. We got tomorrow. We're gonna take her to the beach. Mm. We run around a bit, and then we kind of feed her after midnight. Mm. Gremlin, gremlin rules. Yep. Getting watch, her. Watch Wham! Just give her a whole shit. Like, just try to be extra. I wanted generous. to take her to the beach today. No, they would say no. For sure. And I was like, no, because we were taking her for a guys, walk somewhere, guys, and he I was can, like, I can get so much pussy if I had this dog. He, so we we were taking her for a walk somewhere, and then she was like, oh, I was gonna take her. I guess if you're just got, like if you're gonna steal her from me, and I'm like, you know, I, he was part joking, but I was like, oh. what he... if she sh- like, you know, I want to go to the beach. I'm like, first of all, you don't want her in your car because there's so much, you know, he he doesn't clean his car. There's oh, just like receipts know. and everything everywhere and whatever. Right. And I'm like, well, what about like like when like when she poops and something like, oh, well then I'll just take her off the leash and run away and act like it's someone else's. <laughs> Take her off the leash. Well, yeah, she right, yeah, yeah. like he just run away with her, and I'm like, I'm, no, don't don't take care of my dog. <laughs> like, yeah. I don't want you to. Do you think that would be like similar to an honest move he would make? Oh yeah, no, he he says he finds picking up poop d- d- disgusting. Yeah, nobody likes picking up poop, but I mean, I'm not doing it with my hands. You know what really bugs me out though? Like mostly, mostly I've heard it from like uh, men. Eh, a couple of women. Uh, but I, I, I don't know the women who say it. But just like, yeah, I never cleaned my baby's diaper. That shit is gross. Bullshit. And it's just like, I mean, even if you're trying to save face, like, you're not really saving face. You sound like an asshole. Yeah. Because here's the thing. I don't like shit, but I worked as a fucking nurse for four years. I cleaned everybody's shit. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. Yeah. Like, so cleaning a baby's shit, like... Now, don't get me wrong, my buddy Albert, he's got a newborn kid. If he's just like, oh, no, my baby pooped, I'm not just going to be like, don't worry about it. I'll take care of it. Because it seems weird when you just like, whatever. Now, if I hung out with him every day and all this shit, then it's like, oh, I'll do it. Mm. But if I'm just like there for a weekend, like, I'm not just going to be like, oh, you know what? I've only seen your kid twice in the last uh, one year. Let me clean his- Let me just clean his shit just so I can do it. Like, I'm not going to do that. It's weird. But, so yeah, I just, just clean shit. So <laughs> take up the shit, a, wham. So naturally, Greta's dead, and uh, it's funny because it, she die? It cut back to in the real world and her standing up with her arms out and choking because you know she stuffed it and she and she was just going, ha, 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 and then just fell on the dead table. Yeah, and none of the rich people gave a shit. I'm sure they did, but yeah. yes. But um, but you know, and then it cut to them telling them uh, them finding that guy Mark, the comic book guy, uh. and he was uh, like, "She was living my life, and Ooh. I never had a chance, but I just still went for it." Gretchen? And huh, Gretchen? Yeah. Oh, you see, when he said that, I thought he was talking about fucking pregos. Oh, and because she was pregnant, that he just went for it. <laughs> yeah, no, that's, that's the way. Because no, I saw that, and then I just started looking into it way too deep. I was like. Yeah, you are already all over this, aren't you? Like, I thought he was telling her, like, I just never had a chance. And then yeah. she was just, like, kind of giving him the go-ahead without saying anything. Ooh. The pregnant go-ahead? Yeah. So, yeah, and then... Oh, uh, that changes the whole story. And he kind of starts to believe him, uh, believe about Freddy a bit, you know, yeah. because... Well, he hasn't had his fucking wrist cut. Is not part, yet, right? but okay. he's had... His, he's like, two people are dead. Yeah. I'll, I'll listen. Yeah. Nurse still... This might be more than just a pregnant thing. Nurse still is against it. Indeed. Um. So then, and then Alice is like, I'll I'll tell you about it, but you look a little sleepy. Let, let me leave you alone for a second and make some coffee in this warm right. lighting. Is this where aha happens? Yeah. Okay. So then he gets aha Uh-huh. He, he wakes up and... and so she comes back and he sees her. He sees she sees him in it, and then she draws herself. 
Oh, uh, yeah. That. Oh, I thought that so, came later. So nope, she, draw magic. No, yep. so she walks out and she sees him walking through the comic. Mm-hmm. She's like, oh, no. And she just draws a stick figure and just writes Alice. Yeah. <laughs> and then all of a sudden she's in it. She, just, she, doesn't, she only knows how to draw Spider-Man. And she's like, well, I, I mean, I wanted to be there, but Spider-Man will probably do way better than me. Yeah. But then, yeah. Yeah, why don't you just, yeah. Just super, why don't you just draw Superman. good Freddy? Like, you know, draw Dang. someone who has the same power, but... Just, you can draw anything. So she, so she warps herself into this fucking yeah. wonder world. Walks into this castle because now it's like it's like a really creepy wonder house, world. Right? It's like what happened? It's, it's like a really creepy house, right? It's yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a castle. Well, there's a couple times she goes into this world and it turns into like some weird Mortal Kombat fucking underworld shit. Yeah, that it's. But I think what it is is it's uh, if I remember correctly, it's um, this is the. The town, like the way the town looked at the time, or like the asylum and all that shit. Because remember, which uh, we didn't mention in the very beginning, she, when Amanda's like ghosting away, she says, "You have to find me in the tower." No, in the, you have to find my it's earthly grave, my yeah. earthly resting place. It could be in the tower, yeah. But it's she, so, she you, said you want to say she, she definitely about the tower. said, "Find my earthly resting place." And then, because Freddie commented, he's like, you'll never find the tower. Die, bitch. Because she is. She's like, she's in that castle thing, but there is a tower. Yeah. Like, she, oh. so, yeah, so, whatever. So, yeah, that's the realm that she's in now. So, she and goes then, into this fucking scary-ass house. And finds Mark. And Mark's, like. About to fall into, like, a giant butthole. On his way. Well, no, the, ca- the, uh, it's all gravy. And then the fucking, the carpet opens up. Yeah. And he's hanging in there, like. Trying like trying not to go to hell, is that what it is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because she looks and it's all good, but then I think the carpet opens up, and she's like, "The fuck is this?" And he's like, oh, "Fucking fallen." So she helps him up. He gets up. Some horse shit happens. No, he sees blood on his hands, and if you go back, he doesn't like blood. Yeah, he doesn't like so blood. He faints. He, uh... he faints and then wakes up. Oh, is that okay? So he faints into the. F- Floor. That's where he falls into the floor, into the carpet. I don't think he falls in. I think he kind of disappears because he, he well, wakes he, up. He, well, that's where I'm getting at is he falls into the floor of the first floor. Yeah. Into the floor of the second floor. Yeah. So he falls down up. Yeah. It's a dream. It's so fucking... And then he... There and needs then, to be some sort of substance because you still have to trick the person Jacob to believe that they're up, in a fucking dream. Mark's dream... I kept thinking, is Jacob Freddy? That's that's what I've written here. I I'm on my notes. Everybody, got my notes back. Is Jacob Freddy? Uh, that's what I was thinking then. Mm, I thought that he was like. And then my next sentence is, or is Jacob Alice's future baby? <laughs> I got there quick <laughs> because yeah. he did right there. He did keep saying, um, um. Well, no, because we find out in that scene that he's not Freddy because Freddy's like. Freddy said to me this. Because, Freddy said to me no, that. No, because he keeps saying like, oh, my my friend with the fucking weird hand. Yeah. And then. So he couldn't have been and Freddy. And then he was like, why are you why are you doing this to me? Why do you not want me? And I was like, oh, mm-hmm. abortion. Yeah, there's. Uh, OK, so. So now she talks to uh, Jacob's scary ass is there. Talks to him, whatever, whatever. Mark falls from the first. Uh, oh, this is where this is where it all made sense because my notes now say, "Oh, dreaming baby, duh." Because this is at the point where I feel it realize like this is why she can go in and out of this dream anytime because the baby's dreaming. Yeah. So what it does is that happens, then they cut to her talking to. What is the fucking friend's name? What is the nurse's name? I never got it. Okay, we're just going to call her... Nurse friend. Nurse. So then she talks to nurse, and she's like, hey, can we kind of go get a thing? Because whatever. So she goes to get ultrasound, but nurse is bitching the whole time like, oh, if my doctor finds out, don't open your mouth about this fucking Freddy shit. Yeah. And what does she do? as soon as that happens, the baby's dream? And the guy's like... What are you talking about? Sure. Yeah. And then it turns into something like they dream like 70% of the time or 70% of the time they're in a dreamlike state. She's like, oh, okay. And then all of a sudden her vagina gets electrocuted. 
whatever happens. She gets she gets electronic. Yeah. But it starts from her hoo ha. Because she starts to fall asleep, right? Yeah, but like make it start from somewhere else. Don't just turn her hoo ha into a fucking socket. So I have so Freddy is her dream child, I'm confused. Is in her dream child. She falls asleep on the on the board. How? Ew, unborn baby. Wouldn't be that big. Remember when it when she went in and saw the baby? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. It wouldn't be that big. You'd demon be, child. Like, it'd be it'd be like a little pee. Not a demon child. Demon child's gonna grow a little bit faster. And then we see that Freddy's feeding the baby the souls of his victims. Oh, is that what he's doing? That's we saw really badly edited. We saw the soul of Danny. We saw the soul of Greta. That's probably why I didn't understand. And Greta still has her big face on. Oh yes, yes, yes. Um, I remember that part happening. And then there's oh, then she's hanging out with Mark again, and now we have abortion talk. He was like, did you ever think? And she's like, no, this is all I have left of Danny. Which, I get it. Okay? I get it. Now, the thing is... is, Right after her, Danny's parents just show up. Yeah. Just as she's talking about not getting an abortion. Now, where where do you stand on that? Let's let's talk about abortion as far as it goes in this movie. Not in real life. But let's talk about this. So, abortion, however you stand on it in real life, is what it is. But, now you got this added thing. Demon baby. Now that's gotta that's gotta give you something to scratch your head about because it's like okay so the dude's dead I want to remember him it sucks I'm gonna have to remember him from Demon Baby is this baby gonna be a demon because I'm not condemning an and uh, I'm not condemning condemning anyone who's innocent no well, we're gonna go like this we're gonna say you are eighty five percent sure that this is going to be a demon baby there's a fifteen percent chance it's not gonna be a demon baby but so far. In the last week, everything has pointed to Demon Baby. You've also met your baby. His name's he, Jacob, he and he's a, he's a fucking creep. Well, he's not a demon if he's a creep. Yeah, but he's he's, got, he's very demon-y. He's hanging out with fucking Freddy. Well, because Freddy's hanging out with him. Uh, but he wants to hang out with Freddy. No, I, 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 I think 15's enough to keep the baby. You think so? Yeah. In this instant, I mean, I think, I think she could have put more thought into it. I'm not saying that she should have. She had no time. Have. She had no time. Well, she could have just been like, she could have said something else. But to be 100% sold on like, da da da, it should have been something like, well, I'm going to like, last resort. It's demon baby abortion. Yeah, I suppose. It's a thought. It's definitely a thought. Yeah. But it's, it, but so Danny's parents show up and they're like. Oh, they're trying to buy baby. Is that what they're trying to do? Uh-huh. Uh huh. I thought they were trying to force an abortion too, because they were like, "It, it won't be worth there's, it." There's, there's baby taking talk. No, because they keep telling her, like, "Hey, I mean, you're gonna be a single mom. Like, are you fucking serious? Like, we don't do that in the '80s. Like, you're yeah, gonna, you're, you're gonna die. You're a whore. Like, you're a single mom. You've got you're all die this shit. in the '80s. Yeah, it's just like you've got all this other shit to worry about. Like, just give me the baby. And she's like, so now no, I, I, I wrote give you the baby. So now she has to deal with everything." As like from Freddy, an abortion thought, and then parents trying to take the baby. She has a lot going on She's in, going in her on. life. So hopefully she doesn't make a habit out of this. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Is dinner ready? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mark does his research and finds out that Amanda Kruger killed herself. Mm. But there was no body, and then that there was a funeral. She was buried, but it was an empty oh. cask, and then we don't know where her body is. Did she kill herself or did Freddy kill her? And then all of a sudden... She bought a casket. Nobody had to die. Yeah. And then I also had the great idea of let's try to talk to Amanda. Let me go back to sleep. Mark, if I fall asleep. You know, in the in the classic uh, Freddy, Freddy Krueger move, I'm going to fall asleep, but you watch me. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? If yeah. I do anything, you wake me up because there's no way this is... Not going to work. <laughs> I'd be good at that. I'd be able to stay up and... and, and watch me? Watch if, watch over people. I mean, I would be doing world of other shit. The thing like, is, what I if I was... I would continuously glance behind right, me. So, I'm asleep. I'm right beside you. Yes. I'm I'm telling you I'm going to go fight Freddy. Let's just say we're in the same room. If I do anything, are uh, you going to wake me up right away? Like, dude, that was too soon. I just got one Freddy jump scare. I, I haven't confronted him yet. Um, you, do you know what I mean? Or, you know, because... Yeah. We would have to go back. We would by have the to time have some on sort the second signal. one, like if I'm like, 
dead. You know what I mean? Like, Let's see, but that's I wouldn't be in the dream world, so I wouldn't know how to. No, program. I know you. You're not. Now, if you're, you're just like wiggling, like, uh, uh, then I would just be like, all right, now, now I'm gonna stop what I'm doing over here, and put all of my attention but over to what, Sleepy Matt. What, what's gonna st- like, what if me wiggling I, is me in my dream like, fighting? I would see wiggling, and I'm just like, okay, well, maybe there's something going on here. Obviously, there is something going on, but I don't know. So I would wait for, like, a scream or, like, you to start saying no or maybe swinging. It's likely that you're going to die first Probably. before I wake you up. So, basically, because it's I not understand a good that idea. There's a struggle. It's a bad idea. Okay. So she does that to look for Amanda in the right. safe house. But because- he should be able to draw himself in at any time. No, because she can go in dreams and or something like that. But no, oh, he, okay, he's got the she's got the power. But then the naturally, power. he falls asleep too because he's sitting there in a lightly dimmed room reading comics, and his eyes are getting tired. Mm-hmm. Then he's reading a comic that is everything taking place, right? Remember? Yes, it's a regular comic, but then when he starts reading it backwards, it turns into uh, him and Freddy. And then he sees it, and then he goes into it. Damn right, he does. Aha! And then he. Gets blood on his head. No, Freddy. Fre- Freddy's on a skateboard. Oh, Skater Freddy. Skater. He was a Skater Freddy. I wrote that down with the letter Freddy. or the number eight. Skater. Yeah. 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 B O I. Boy. Ooh, I didn't do. I just wrote Skater Kruger. Skater Kruger. Skater Kruger. You know Ooh. what? Chad, 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 Chad Kruger married Avril Lavigne. So he could have been a Skater. Could have been a Skater Kruger. Could have. Is that was is that what happened? They they're not married anymore, but they were married. Who was that? Was that some forty one? No, that's. I thought some forty one was, was piping. Shoot, he was David. Fuck, what's his some name? Some forty one underrated band. I hated them when they first came out. But oh they're, no, no, they're no. talented. Some I like some forty one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I wouldn't listen. to them. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> you just gave him a shout out there. I did. I said they're talented. Oh, uh, Beatles are talented, but I don't like them. Oh. <laughs> That's a podcast you've been waiting to happen. I don't know. No, because I've talked about it plenty of times. I'm just saying. I'm just showing. That's all. Um. So we. So, so they're 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 fighting. He's he's skateboarding he and chasing him with his stupid shit. And then he knocks over all the pile, and then like you know he gets the whole thing knocked on him because Freddie's knocking over the the poles to yes. support the what whatever. Yes. And then he wakes up, and then he gets like blood on his face, which he doesn't mm-hmm. faint because it's Greta's blood. Right. He brought Greta back, and yeah. he's still... That's how close he's got to be. He's still killing her. Yeah. Well, he's he's up on the... He's up high now, right? And he's yeah. got Greta, and he just, like, pushes her. Yeah. And then she turns into a doll, which is a... Because, a remember, in her room, earlier. there was so many dolls in her room? Yeah. 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 And then this causes Mark to turn into... The Phantom... Comic book commando guy? No, he, he made a comic book, the Phantom something. Oh, really? Yeah, I can't remember what it was. Yeah. Uh. It wasn't good. It was a bad... But, you know, it's a good idea. If you're fighting Freddy, use your dream to your advantage. Definitely. Definitely. Like, like, and it seemed to have worked, but unfortunately, Freddy can't die in dreams. He cannot. Sucks. So you'd have to figure out how to bring him into real life. That's why they did that in the first one, where she set up Home Alone. Yeah. Ugh. How did she bring him into the real world? Uh, she set a timer for 20 minutes, ended up doing about two and a half hours worth of shit in 10 minutes, and then fell asleep to find him controlled her dream because that's when her and Johnny Depp t- had a conversation about how to control your dream. She controlled him, brought him into the dream world that's at her house and then woke up like holding him or something, which brought him into the real world. Some bullshit, some shit that shouldn't have happened. Of course. And then she home alone the shit out of him because she had b- bobby traps and fucking, uh, uh, booby traps and and sledgehammers hung on ceilings. It wasn't worth it. It was bad. Okay. So yeah, so I guess you can bring him in to the real world. For so you. yeah. But then he basically he turns what he tur- he turns him into col- into paper. Yes, he does. A very turn him gory, into paper. but not gory death. Very colorful, gory. Yeah. Yeah. Smart death. So he turns into it was a good he one. turns Mark into a piece of paper and he cuts him with his side and then all the color fades from his body. That's he goes correct. on the floor. Then he keeps cutting yeah. the paper. Which I was all like, Yeah, that's yeah. a smart way to do yeah. a death like that. Actually looked good, like the color fading, like yeah. that was a good a good little effect. Probably wasn't as hard as most other things. No, but, but it was, it was clever. It, it looked nice, yes. 
Um. Then the nurse is like, "Yeah, I I, I finish up a shift. I'm gonna go to the pool. Hey, mm-hmm. it's just like hot tub still open." And she just goes to the hot tub. This happens before that, but yes. Yeah, but we've already covered him dying, and it's right, it's right. it's going back and forth between that. Mm-hmm. Right? No. Oh, All well, that should happen. All that should happens first. It's after, um, after the the baby talk, the uh baby, baby buying. Then yeah. it cuts to her like at the swimming pool. Then she gets chased up. Diving bird turns into claws. She jumps, like, trying to get away from it, and the pool has no more water. And then it's just a little puddle that she dives into, and then she ends up in hell, too. Yeah. And then they just cut over to all this shit happening. Rock and roll happens as well. (laughs) Apparently. A lot of rock and roll happens. And then, so Alice goes in, so Alice finds Freddy with the nurse in the the little well of water. Yeah, 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 because she ends up in there, yeah. stabs Freddy in the head with the thingy. Which, if Freddy's all... Remember, he, she has, like, a pole, and, like, mm-hmm. it obviously doesn't kill him, but I feel like nothing if nothing should be able... Like, I know for plot, but I know nothing should be able to stop him. He'd just be like, ha, 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 and just would just keep going. He's like, ah, ah, ah. Yeah, he should still get stunned. Really? You think? I think he should get stunned. Technically, no, because he's like a dream lord. You know what I mean? He's yeah, but he should still get like Wolverine, like stunned, to where like it, it'll slow him. Down. It's not gonna stop him, but it'll slow him down. Ooh, Freddy versus Wolverine. Who wins that one? Where are they in Freddy's dream? Mm, purgatory. Ooh, Wolverine. More skill. Yeah, yeah, it would have to be Wolverine. That's a dumb question. Yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah, so they run into the safe area that is the little house. Mm-hmm. Then, Jacob's house. Huh? Jacob's house. Yeah. Yes. And then they, what, do they wake up and... Mm, no, because she she gets all fucking hellbent on, I'm going to stop you. Where are you, Freddy? Come out, Freddy. I think. And then he's like, he's looking around for something and she comes and attacks his ass with the... The scary stroller, and then with, pushes with the spiky him. Spiky stroller, yeah, and pushes him into the lunatics. Ah, uh, yes, that is what happens. Yeah, no, he, that's and, a bit later, and he gets but, pregnant. But that, yeah, and then the cycle continues. Which is that, that's a he bit later. Does give birth later, but before that, he, uh, uh, they wake up in the real world. Oh no, no, the lunatics rip his arm off. Yeah, but that's also a bit later. No, no, no. Crib stab pushes him in there, and then there's a bunch of hollabaloo. He gets his arm ripped off right there. And then his arm turns into spiders. That Yeah. And then, arm turns into spiders. And then and he I, meets... Then, I think then, that's then when it's, it, it does a flip. And then Freddy and Jacob are talking. Mm-hmm. And they do the whole run around that impossible staircase. Oh, that shit. Fuck that I shit. I hate that kind of effect. That's like what cartoons, like in a in an infinite hallway where it's just one door, the other door, the other door, Scooby-Doo. Yeah. Like, oh. I saw that and I was like, I like, I like the infinite staircase imagery. In like, if it was in like a Dalai Lama esque painting, or you know what I mean, in like some artsy sense. Yeah, but not this. When they wake up and Mark's dead, and the police are like, you know, shock blankets and you know, doing the whole like check the area. Yes. When the police guards was like, um, well, what do you say? Man, n- nothing was up to code. It, it's it, it's lucky both of you aren't dead. <laughs> talking about Freddy, uh, sorry, talking about Mark and Alice while the nurse nothing wo- was woke up, up woke up in the hot tub because that's you know. Oh yes, all sleep in a hot tub. Did they make a hot tub joke? Like I'm not getting in a hot tub again. Yeah. No, or I'm not, getting with, I'm not getting God with. I'm not God damn it! I'm not get. I'm not getting in the hot tub with him again. Oh yeah. God damn it. <laughs> and then I, I just have written here, 20 minutes left. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm I'm checking out at this point as well. I mean, I've been checking in and out the whole time. But I will say that I, there was a very minimal time when I decided to just start paying attention to my phone. When did you, um, when did you d- d- decide to hashtag sh- shut it down? Uh, when did I hashtag shut it down? You you told me you watched it. Did did, did you ever just? 
Um, you know what? Once I started watching the other ones, is when it was hashtag shut it down real quick. Hashtag shut it down. Yeah, because this was like I had no, I had, had no idea what to expect. So Alice is being taken home by her father. He's mm-hmm. like, time to go home. You've had enough right. of this. And then Alice is screaming. You haven't at, finished dinner yet. Alice is screaming at dinner's friend to go find Amanda's earthly body. Earthly. Yeah. Find it. Yeah. yeah go yeah. find it. Yeah, but in so the that's, tower that's, that still it has is. to be in the fucking dream go world. Go find it. Don't care. Just go find it. Yeah. Now, uh, Alice is calling Kruger out in, in her dreams uh, while nurse friend is dangerously searching alone in an abandoned asylum. <laughs> you know. As is, Kruger yeah, shows up. Uh, she's not. She's not a target because, um, what's her name? Uh, Alice ha- is like hanging out with Jacob. So, so what's her name's not a target. So what? So yeah. So Alice in the dreams. Alice shows up. Sorry, Kruger shows up in Alice's dreams, and that's when the whole cart into the asylum, like in into the the, the, the the lunatics happens. You, you just skipped a little bit, but it's no, 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 big deal. no, no, no. My my notes are in order. My notes are in order too, and I have Mark's death. Please show up, man. Nothing was up to code. I literally write as I'm going. Yeah, yeah, I do too. And then I wrote twenty minutes left, and then nurse friend goes to asylum to see if she can find a mile, uh, Amanda, and Alice falls asleep back home. Yeah, yeah, because I've got so yeah, so board, Kruger blah, shows blah, up blah. in Alice's dreams and is. Tricked by her ramming cart in his back and chokes him into the lunatics that raped his mother. They start tearing him apart and his amputated arm turns into spiders. See, I've got that way earlier. Because, yeah, diving board, eaten by comic book, skater Kruger, fuck did he turn into, crib stab, lunatic, stupid, what? Stupid stair trick. Yeah, that it's that's all now. The weird body morph. Yeah, you're basically finishing up. You just didn't write that scene in. That's all. The one I just mentioned before. You just didn't have it. Anyway. Uh, Maybe. So, so you know, his, he turns into spiders and then is all of a sudden talking to Jacob with his, like, six six feet arm. Yeah, you got that big arm. Like, because he just tore it off. That was the big arm he had earlier. Yeah. It kind of made sense, I guess, in the Freddy world. And then that's when the whole fucking stair stair thing happened. That was just like... Shut up. You do it once in Labyrinth, and then that's all you got to do it in. You You do it? Labyrinth with David Bowie? It's a great movie. No, but they're coming out with a new series. No. Netflix is coming out with the Labyrinth series. Don't, Don't do it. I have nothing to do with it. I was I was suggested to watch it because it might be something that was up my alley. But I know I know nothing about it except for some more Jen H- Jim Henson shit, which I'll give him credit any day of the week. So then Alice decides that she's gonna pull cre- pull Freddy out of herself. Yeah, yeah, that was so dumb. she turns into Freddy first. I only think that she turned into Freddy first. You know what I mean? Like she gets the Freddy face, and then she's yeah, like yeah, Freddy yeah. face. All. I only think they wanted to do that because they could. You know what I mean? Like this is a let, let let's get a weird body morphing scene going. Yeah, because yeah. we we got a budget. We're about two thousand off. <laughs> right. We didn't spend eight eight eighty thousand dollars. There was on one corn. bit where their faces were like melded together, but a thumb was sticking out to this side, and you could just tell it's. Either Robert England or somebody just behind it going, ah, 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 ah. So check this out. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> the tongue makes an appearance in every movie. Really? Yeah. In one of them, when Freddy Krueger turns into that girl, she's spitting tongues at at the dude to like tie him up. There is one, and I think the second one, where what happens is every time somebody gets kissed, it turns into that tongue. Like, homeboy's about to fucking hook up and, and sex up this lady, and he's kissing all down, and all of a sudden, weird tongue comes out. Ooh. And then some other motherfucker's making out, and all of a sudden, weird tongue's just hanging out. Ooh. Weird tongue happens a lot. I don't know Freddy, what his Freddy fucking trip the, is with Freddy this likes shit. likes the tongue, yeah. But yeah, a lot of tongue. Um. So now, okay, so we got the body morph. Yeah, yeah. And then... 
But why the nurse both? finds yeah. the body and then releases her? All she was touches her. Touches That's her it. and then she disappears. Thank you. Yeah, but That's she it. touches her into a skeleton. And turns into... Uh, and then it turns into her. Yeah. And then it's just like, bye. So that's bad. That's just um, fucking terrible. Jacob becomes a little... Oh, sorry. So she shows up, and she's like, Freddie... I mean, Jacob, you have the power to stop him. Use the power he gave you. And then he turns into, like, l- like little Freddy. Yeah. He gets, turns into little Freddy. Which, according to... So remember when he said, uh, school's Ed Kruger? Yeah. Apparently, was... A replacement line when the actor who was the who was a minor at the time, obviously, wasn't p- permitted to say "fuck you, Kruger." <laughs> you could you, that could you could have made that happen. You could have made a kid say "fuck you, Kruger." Yeah, well, I mean, if you got what's her name, fucking fifteen years old in the Blue Lagoon, getting butt ass naked, yeah, this little Kruger. kid could say "fuck you, Kruger." Um. So. Jacob goes into Freddy and pulls out all the souls that and 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 this Greta one's still screaming. Yes, I know they are. I know they all are, but you could just hear her still going. I'm like, shut up! Like, yeah. So it's like their faces Intention, pulling yeah. Freddy's back. Like they're like like this is like oh, this is yeah. Wes Craven. I know it's not him, but this isn't this is like an influence. You know what I mean? Like this yeah. is this is not a special effect. This is. As practical uh, as you can get, it's so and it's bad. it's cool, but they're pulling him closer to Amanda, and then Amanda puts him back in his belly, her belly. Uh, yeah, face. And then there's a an aborted fetus from Freddy. Freddy aborts something. He like aborts himself. Yeah. And then, homegirl gets pregnant again, like yes. repregnant. Oh yeah, the baby gets back in there. Yeah, which is a weird concept. Uh huh. But I guess, like, that's how she's going to take him home or, like, take him to away. Yeah. To a Waysville. And then. Months later. Alice gets pregnant again? Yeah. Like, she gets repregnant? They they both turn into babies, and then and then so the baby gets back, goes back in her. So I don't know. I didn't even know what left. I got Jesus magic, unaborted double unabortion. <laughs> this is what I got. Unaborted double unabortion, yes. Huh. Nicely said. And then, um, oh, and then they show a close-up of the baby's face. Looks like the baby's been dropped a couple of times. The face looks rough. Ooh. Like, there's, there's that's, like, uh, red marks and, like, later. blotches everywhere. Didn't, that's, like, bad mother. Should have so gave the baby back. Everyone's so happy. Most of their friends are dead. Oh, the new baby. That baby's going to die. Baby's not going to die. You know what I mean? Like, in the next one. And Freddy's not gone. He was laughing or something. Oh, no, yeah. At the end of it, every movie... They've got Freddy. Like, one of them, Freddy was, like, the rag top to the car, and he controlled the car. You don't know which one where the person got grabbed? Oh, the, or was that in Jason? No, Freddy, where she, the the person got pulled into the... the, the look up on the bed? YouTube there. What am I looking up? Wrong Freddy, house. Freddy pulls through window. Uh... What did I just watch one of them jump through a window and it looked like they magic the shit out of it? Freddy pulls through a window. No. Uh, Is that it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Up. Oh. So that's the first one. Okay, click that. You can edit this, can't you? Now kinda of go towards the end. Yeah, see, that's he's a he's a rag top. There, yeah, here. Wait for nope. it. Watch it. <laughs> oh, Jesus! So yeah, that was the first one. Yeah, that was a weird effect. Oh, uh, it's what eighty four? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'll you know, if it, you yeah. do a. Thing like that fast enough, yeah, it looks good. Like back yeah, then, yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel you, I feel you. Um, claymation, claymation, and then yeah, everyone's happy. Uh, Freddy Five done. Oh my god! I don't know why you would name it Jacob. Well, like the, because didn't named she, itself. Did she you name it obliged. Jacob? Dan- she named it Jacob Danny. Yeah. What she should, if she would have named it Danny Jacob, that'd be different. Like because the whole point was to commemorate. 
the fallen. Mm-hmm. So should dad's we, no longer there. Should be Jacob. No, no. Oh, sorry. Yeah, it should, should be, be Danny Jake, Jacob or Jacob or sorry or Mark Danny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give Greta. all the name. Jacob should not be a leading name. Greta Danny Mark. <laughs> yeah, Greta Danny. Yeah, Danny even Jr. That. Even that would be fine. So let's 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 have our little segment here where we look at the trivia for th- this movie. Um. Let me ask you, do you know where they got the the idea for Freddy's face makeup? No, where? Pepperoni pizza. Ooh. Uh-huh. Ooh. Well, look at pepperoni pizza the same. Somebody they were talking about it. A homeboy ordered a pizza and then he was he had an aha moment. This is a documented thing. Do you know why they chose that color pattern for his sweater? What? Apparently, it is very difficult for the the mind to blend those two colors. Like those are, those are the two. Uh, red and green is the hardest color combo to process. Apparently, which is good. Did you like know that. that the laughter heard at the end, right before the credits roll, is the clip of Vincent Price laughing at the end of Michael Jackson's song Thriller? I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't I actually didn't know which one came first. The film opened at number three in the box office, but it disappeared thereafter, and it was the lowest grossing film in the franchise. The fifth one? Yeah. Robert oh. England stated that the film was a success. Oh. Well, I mean, it's like horror movie success is different from mainstream success, I believe. In the documentary, Never Sleep Again, The Elm Street Legacy 2010, director Stephen Hopkins admitted that Though Mark's death scene was silly, the comic one, mm-hmm. but being a comic book nerd, he just had to put it in there. Just had to. Just had to. Stingy son of a bitch. No, there's there's fun stuff like going over it on YouTube. And by saying I, that, like, I, I, I don't like remember it. Freddy. I like Freddie. I like that idea. I think it's smart. Freddie is smart. You don't know. It's it's a very it's a very crafty idea, but it came from. Um, how did he get it? I think Wes uh, Wes Craven at some point was in his room one day when he was a, a child. Yeah, and just saw some creepy ass man like hanging out outside, and then like he ran with it, and apparently this is how the story developed, or like this is how all this shit came to be by just some weird ass old man in the streets. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. No, no, you're right. I can see that because he's, he's yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm sure there was quite a few rough drafts because I don't think you're just going to jump from like, I just think why is that man in the street to, oh, he might be the fucking killer from the dreams. very original idea. I always I always thought Freddy was original. Like, you know. No, it is a very Jason good idea. Jason he, he he can be. I I feel that people have added to him over the years. Mm-hmm. He started as something, but they just added more and more. Mm. Uh, now, here's one. Who would you put f- uh, a Freddy against in like a Freddy versus? Uh, um, the Blair Witch? Like, are, we, are, we, are we staying in this fucking in this, this genre, this horror genre? Sure. Well, I mean, there's got to be Freddy versus person. Cloverfield. Ooh. Godzilla. I mean, now here's the unthin- unfair thing about Freddy is like, he's gonna lose unless he's in the dream world. So you would have to have somebody else who could, like, live in the dream world, and, and be whatever. Like, because even if we go back to the original, the whole Wolverine conversation, like, yeah, like Wolverine would it would be a really good fight in the dream world. But the thing is, is if Freddy just simply cannot die, yeah, then it just doesn't make it fair. So you can't really put him up, like. Yeah, it'd be fun to see Godzilla fuck with them, but it wouldn't really matter if they were in the dream world. But if they were in the real world, again, it wouldn't matter because Godzilla would just fuck them up real quick. And what was the plot of Freddy vs. Jason? Because then it's the same idea. I, yeah. I I know I I know I I know I have seen that one, but I don't recall what it is. I think at the end. But is is it because like? So so Jason uh, so Jason's dead already. So, so like, Jason goes to hell. That might be why. That that's a movie. Yes. 
And then at the end of that, Jason's mask is on is on like sand, and then Freddy's claw hand comes out and carries it down. Oh. That's what happens. And then you know, the alien skull is in the background of the predator ship kind of thing. You know, right? That's exactly how that happens. Yeah. No, I I don't know how to explain it unless it's because Jason's already in hell. Yeah. No. And in, Freddy's... in Freddy versus, so basically, Freddy's like everyone forgot about me. Let's have Jason kill people on Elm Street to re- remember me. I think that's what happened. Ah, uh, he controls them? Yeah, and then Freddy's like, hey, wait a minute. Sorry. Well, because and Jason's then, easily controllable, right? Yes, like, for the but then he, he cups on, I think. Yeah, every time. And then it's like, wait a sec. No, and yeah. then people are like, he's taking my kills. Because yeah. he, he, he gets into pe- to people's dreams, and then while they're dreaming, J- Jason kills them. And he's ah. like, that's my kill. Oh. Rawr. Tell me how That's, my my Freddie impression is. Tweet, uh, tweet at us. <laughs> yeah, let us know. Yeah, but I think um, what's it called? But even in like the video game, from what I understand, the Jason video game. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, the, the new one. Yeah, like that's how you beat him. You fool him by like getting the sweater, and Jason's like, "Oh no, that's my mom's sweater. So you must be my mom." And then like somebody else shoots him in the face or something. Like, <laughs> wow. So you heard it here first, guys. He's pretty susceptible. Tips. Tips. Get the sweater. Shoot him in the face. Final thoughts? I it's I ain't gonna bullshit. It's a fun series. Like if if it was that bad, I wouldn't sit here and go through the other ones. Like I'm going to continue with it and see you think what the that rest they could are. do a TV show? They shouldn't. No? They like like, like like not one where Freddie hosts it, like one about Freddie? Um, yeah, they could. I mean, fuck, they made Gotham. Huh? <laughs> so they made Gotham, so I'm sure they can do whatever. Oh, man, Freddy Origin? Oh, one about Freddy become, one about Freddy killing all those kids. Yeah, they would definitely do that. Yeah, they could, they could do that. Idiot. But I don't, like, after, after a season, it's going to be stupid. Yeah, it'll be like the Hannibal series. So they would have to do, like, they would just have to do a reboot. I mean, just say fuck it and give it back to Rob Zombie. And let him do it. Or not back to him, but give it to him. Let him do that. Yeah, yeah. Um, thank you for recently liking us. We mm-hmm. um uh, appreciate it. Um, any tips or anything? Or uh, anything like that? Any questions, comments, or concerns? Mm-hmm. Email us at what is it, the Mars Pod at Gmail. The Mars Pod at Gmail. We're on Facebook and Twitter at the Mars Podcast. Uh, at the Twitter Mars. is at the Mars Pod. Facebook is dot com slash the Mars Pod. Uh, yes, thank you. Uh, Have a great night. Thank you much. See you next week.